Babes. Okay. This is festive season. And I know the Yankee girls are going to come around. What am I even saying? I'm pretty sure they are in town already. Mm -hmm. Yankee mm -hmm. guys are in town. But baby, you're taking now. See who is talking. That's one that's taking you. Hmm. Last I checked, I am not yet married to any guy. Am I? Brenda. Mm? What is going on? Wait, I hope you do not have any plan of dumping this month. That guy has done a lot for you, you know. What did he do for me? Hmm? What? Desmond saw you through the university. He practically did everything for you. Your feeding, your clothing, your... Enough, enough. <laughs> so because he helped me during my school days, I should not desire to marry a Yankee guy. A Yankee sweet, handsome man. In case you forgot, let me tell you. The reason why he did all of that was because you both are engaged. Ready to marry. Uh -huh. No, don't dump this guy. Don't dump him. Juliet, you're beginning to sound like a preacher to me. Anyway, everyone is entitled to their own opinion. As for me, Brenda, I know what I want. And when I see him, I'll know. But you see Desmond, he's certainly not the one for me. Forget that. Brenda. Brenda, I am talking to you as a friend. Do not do this. It doesn't make any sense. Don't, don't leave this guy heartbroken. Please. Wait, are you being real right now? Chili. Take a proper look at me. Of course I am looking at you, girl. Take a look at me. I can see you. I am a very beautiful lady. No doubt. With all the curves. In the right places. <laughs> Come on, girl. You don't expect me to give all of this to a guy that resides. Brenda, in... please stop talking. Stop. <laughs> I'm sure you still have conscience, so think. My darling, my destiny is not here. My destiny is abroad. And I'm going to marry a man that lives overseas. You get it? You get it. Is this Brenda? She's a... Brenda, please, do not... Hey, you know the Yankee guys are in town this festive season? I know. My eye, they chuko. <laughs> Brenda, huh? this month is there. Don't forget. Okay. What's that? What's that now? <laughs> I hope you know what I'm thinking. Brenda. Yeah, this keke guys. What are you thinking? Hi, ladies. Hi. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, my name is Murphy. My name is Brenda. Oh, nice name. What about you? I'm Juliet. Oh, nice name. Can I call you Julie? It's okay, sir. Oh, you're, you're beautiful, you know? You see, I'm not really into light-skinned women, but uh, I, I like your calves. You, you look really cool. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Where, where are you guys headed? <laughs> We're going to the salon to get our hair done. Oh, great. C can I drop you guys off? Sure, why not? All right, hop in, let's go. Yes. Yeah, man. So I saw Beep now. Ah, she's good. Mind you. She's good. As beautiful as always. So, um, how are you guys planning for this year to two? 
Um, my plan now is to go see her parents for the marital rights. As soon as possible, anyway. <laughs> see my guy. <laughs> I like the way you're sounding right now. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Thank you, man. Whoa. Yeah. She must be very elite. No. That you guys are about cementing what you guys started years ago. The truth is that I've not told her anything. You know, I, I have this plan that I'll go for the trial first. Mm -hmm. Then maybe by Easter, we'll have our wedding. Mm -hmm. But I'll definitely tell her at any time. It's going to be a surprise. Yeah, sure. You know, women, they like this eight-letter word, marriage. Exactly. They love it like marriage. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know, love is a beautiful thing. See, love is a beautiful thing. With the right person, anyway. Yeah, sure. You know... As sweet as what sounds yeah. is what experience with the right woman, you know. Exactly, exactly. Yes. <laughs> you know, I honestly, I can't wait to make her my permanent wife. She's a beautiful thing in my life. <laughs> this is nice. This is nice. Well, I wish you guys the very best. Thank you, bro. Thank you, man. <laughs> You're doing well. Yeah, and thank you for your you know, encouragement. I always wish you guys to end up you know, together. Yeah, this is my wish. Thank you. I'm thank so happy you. for you. Thank you for your support. You are doing well, bro. <laughs> You're doing well. Thank you. <laughs> so, Juliet, what do you do for a living? Uh, well, I just graduated from the university. Oh, great. What did you study? I studied civil law. Oh, law. That's great. So you're going to be a lawyer, huh? Yes, by the special grace of God. Mm. Oh, nice. I just uh, finished my master's in Canada. I got back last week. I knew it! Sorry, you knew what? I mean, it's all over your appearance. Well, congratulations, sir. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, I appreciate it. You're welcome. Juliet, can I get your number so I can call you sometime? It's okay, it's fine. I want to call you. I hope you don't mind. Yeah. Thank you. So I turn left, huh? Oh yes. All right, just tell me when to stop. Okay, I will. Honestly, I will not trade Brenda with anything in the world. I can't watch her get married to any man at all. Uh, life would be meaningless without her, honestly. Yeah, sure. Not after spending several years together. The only thing that comes to mind is marriage. Exactly. Exactly. You can't even decide otherwise. Not after spending a fortune to make her a better woman. Brenda is someone I met when she was just a male girl. I watched her grow into this beautiful, sexy woman. <laughs> no, I will not allow anybody in this life to take her away from me. <laughs> no, no, not ever. Brenda loves you so much, and she can't chill you right now. Not after everything both of you share. You're, you're right, you're right, but the truth is, you know, this is Christmas. Christmas is approaching. And you see all these guys from Yankee come out, throw dollar, pounds all around her. <laughs> well, I pray they don't lure her into marriage. That's just it. You know, as a man, I have to think far. What are you even talking about? That means she doesn't love you that much. Why do you think so? If she can be cajoled with money, that means she doesn't watch your love. I don't think so. But the truth is that she is mine and nobody in this life. Nobody in this life will take her away from me. 
Mm -hmm. I brought this for you. Let me get the table. Thank you, Thank you very much. Uh, how is Brenda? Uh, Brenda is fine. She's fine. Thank you, ma. You're welcome. <laughs> Mom, they are getting married very soon. Wow. Yes. That's so nice. Thank you, ma. In fact, I wish you all the best. <laughs> Congratulations in advance. Thank you. Oh, pardon my manners. Let me get the table. It's okay. Have you seen him since then? No, no, no. Hmm? Well, I'll try. I will go and see him maybe after you must have gone. Okay. Mr. Murphy, sir. Okay. Not yet, but we'll soon be done. Really? So, are you home now? Why? What exactly are you thinking about, sir? Sorry, Murphy. What? Just like that? No, not really. <laughs> I don't even know you that well, and I'm even surprised you're asking me to... You don't expect me to believe that, do you? Okay. Why the mood swing? Why is your face like that? Brenda, I'm... I'm in a state of confusion right now. The guy we caged the lift in his car just asked me to marry him. <laughs> oh my goodness. For real. A guy just met a few minutes ago is asking you to marry him. It's crazy, right? <laughs> Please don't mind him more. He's not used to get married. You just need somebody asking him to marry you. I'm sure he's just being sarcastic. In as much as I know that this guy is cute and well educated, I also know marriage is not a thing that you can just jump into when, you know, it's something you have to be careful about. I'm happy you know about it. I mean, that means you're even considering it for you to be sounding this way. My sister, marriage is not something you just dabble into because some guy is rich and based abroad, Yankee guy. No, that's not what marriage is all about. For course. What? Brenda. Hmm? Who be you the talk say you want Yankee guy? What do they worry you? I don't understand. Where you stand? I know why I'm saying what I'm saying. 
Yeah, I know, but like the same thing where you want now. I say, don't show for me. Why you can't they discourage me? No. Anyways, I will think about it. Uh, okay, um, just think well. They are calling us. Do you want the other girl to take over? Let's go and do our hair and get going. Juliet is not so beautiful, but she looks humble. Sounds intelligent too. She seems like a good girl. And I think I want to make her my wife. I'll do everything to make her my wife. I'm saying is that you should decline this guy. Yes, you don't even know him that much, do you? Brenda, you told me you wanted a Yankee guy as a husband, right? And now a Yankee guy is asking for my hand in marriage. You're not comfortable with that. What's going on? Girl, I have a feeling that this guy wants to do something with you. Really? And he, yes, and he wants to use his mind as a disguise to get to you. Okay, it's fine, girlfriend. We shall see about that. Good. That's why I like you. You have sense. This guy is... No, you, you don't look good. Are you okay? I'm good. How come you were busy in my call while I was trying to call you? I was in a very noisy environment. No, oh, it's alright. That's alright. Oh, your hair is fine. That's lovely, babes. <laughs> Thank you. It's nice. Eh? Oh, babes. Guess what? You know I cannot guess. Okay. Just talk. What is it? Okay. You, you, you remember the company I submitted my proposal to? That's uh, Macombs Limited. Baby, you know, you know what? I won it. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That's, are you serious? I'm serious. You, you, know, the, you, know, you know why I'm happy? Why? After doing the contract, I'm going to have a lot of money. That means by December, we'll get married. <laughs> yes! My girl is getting married! Girl, this is so exciting. This is yes. an exciting news. Yes. First, you are now a graduate. And secondly, you will be getting married this December. Girl, this is exciting. What is wrong with you? <laughs> ah, Ugo. I'm coming. Ugo. What is wrong with you? Ah, 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 what is it now? What? Babes, what is wrong with you? Why are you suddenly growing cold towards your man? Don't you have any explanation to make? I owe no one any explanation. Listen, it is my life. And I know what's best for me. What stupid life are you talking about, Brenda? Brenda, this is Desmond we're talking about. What has he done so differently to deserve this kind of embarrassment from you? 
Well, let's just say I lost interest. You lost what stupid interest? Brenda! I don't want to do again now. I don't want to do. Brenda, you know what do waiting exactly. Like, I've lost interest. You've completely lost it, Brenda. What are you talking about? That guy went out of his way to submit that proposal to Macon's Limited. Linda, you told me about it. We both prayed about it and asked God that this comes true for him. And now God did it. You are not even excited for your own man. What's come over you? Okay, you know what? Let me spell it out for you. This whole marriage thing, I mean, this whole marriage thing is not gonna work. I want out. Oh, Brenda! Babes, is this still going to come? I mean, you can never take this guy seriously. He gave me his words. So, he's definitely going to come. <laughs> but you've been waiting for over an hour now. Or are you going to wait indefinitely? Brenda, it's obvious something is keeping him. Besides, I'm already waiting for him. Mm, you're right. But it's just that we both know what this guys of nowadays are capable of doing. Who knows if he's with one girl smooshing and making out with her and keeping you here waiting. You know, you can never trust these guys. Let me be the one to bother myself with that. Yeah. So where is he taking you to? His house or a five-star restaurant or hotel? None of that. He said he wants me to come know his place. Wow! Yes. Yes. Let me come with you now. No, Brenda, it's a date for two. <laughs> you can come with me. But girl, see, you never can tell. Maybe one or two of these guys that came back from overseas with him might be around and might find me attractive. <laughs> you want a Yankee man? What then yeah. happens to that man? What about him? <sighs> Must you bring him into a conversation? Yes, because it's important. Did you ask her what the problem is? She was practically cool towards me. As if she didn't even see me. No, no, no. This is not normal. The Brenda I know will jump into your arms the moment she sees you. Do you know sometimes I'm even jealous of you guys the way you love each other? I think there's something wrong. Something is definitely wrong. Yes, something is definitely wrong. For you to tell her that you're getting married to her this festive period and she didn't show any form of excitement, that's, that shows that Something is definitely wrong with her. And she refused to mention what the problem is. Honestly, I, I'm confused. But yeah. I think uh, I'm going to give her a call to know what the problem is. Yes. I, I can't afford to lose that girl, honestly. I can't afford to lose her. This is not right. This is not right at all. You know, I always wish that you guys end up as husband and wife. I pray nothing happens, honestly. I just pray. Don't worry, bro. I'll talk to her. It's okay? All right. It's alright. Thanks, man. Let's Thanks. take it easy. It's all right. I told you I don't want him anymore. I had no water in my mouth when I said that to you. Brenda, you're always all over this guy before. 
What happened? What changed? My love for him died like dead and buried. What part of English do you not understand? Huh? Hi, Juliet, tell me, what has Desmond done that no man has ever done for anybody before? What's all so this about? Desmond, Desmond, Desmond. What has he really done? You know exactly what I'm talking about, and I'm sure you know what you're doing. Of course. I like the sound of that. I know what I am doing. <laughs> okay. So, girl, does that mean that I can come? Let me get dressed. Which time will have me this one? Don't tell me you're serious. Of course I am dead serious. Forget this month. Kill, I am done. Like, your babes is done. Done for good. Don't leave this guy heartbroken. Don't leave him messed up. This guy loves you, you know. Okay. My sister, breakfast is for everybody. Now, when you reach your turn, you chop out. Drink water, clean mouth. Let me get dressed. Brenda. Yeah, girl. Why are you going dressed like this? How? There's nothing wrong with what I'm wearing. Everything is wrong with what you are wearing. Girl, your boobs is almost out. It's just that Morphe's friends might be there. So I'm trying to dress to kill to actually the kind of man I want. Oh, really? You're going to Morphe's house to sell a market? Huh? Peter, please, I don't like this. I don't like this. What? What is your plan? I like what I'm wearing. I don't like it. And I'm sure Movie won't buy this. This is so revealing now. Yo, come on. This is my date, not yours. Hope you know that. I can still grab one or two. Hope you know that. Yo, please now. Not do me like this. I don't want this guy to see me like one of those cheap girls or a loose one. This is Hong Kong. I don't know. I'm good. How are you? Of course, I'm all dressed. Really? I will be out soon. Is he? Yes. No, I have to wait for you. Sorry. What was that for? Juliet, don't just start. The question is, why did you do that? Baby, it's simple. I do not want this engagement ring to be bad market for me. You know the vibe now. Oh, so you now have a product that you want to go to Morphe's house to sell? Brenda, please, I beg you in the name of God. I do not want this guy to see me like a cheap girl or one of those loose girls. <sighs> Babe, he's waiting. Let's just go have fun. Let's go. Girlfriend, I hope you do not have any plan of snatching Murphy away from me. My goodness. How can you say such a thing to me? Because I don't understand this whole drama you are performing. I don't. And I know you do not want me to follow, but I must. Let's go. I don't trust you, and I have my eyes on you. No problem. Hi. 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 Hi.
want to hold you tight so we can walk it. So now you're Yes. Of oh my goodness! Your house is so beautiful! You like it? I love it! Oh, you great. sure have a great taste. Oh, yes. Thank you very much. Let's go, please. Come. Wow! He's showering her with lots of love already. Hmm. Yeah, come in. Um, are you surprised? Obviously, I am. I mean, your place is so beautiful. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, please make yourself comfortable. I'll get you something to drink. What, what, what would you want? Sorry. Um, anything soft. Anything soft. I'll get you something soft. Make yourself comfortable, right? Why are you not so lucky to attract such a man? Did you say lucky? Girl, the universe has blessed me. Hey! God! This is something I never prayed for. Babe, where are his friends now? One or two guys around. Let me see if I can. Friends, that's one person. Are you blind? Can't you see it doesn't have any? There's no one in this house. This is uh, all I could find. Uh, this is all I could find. It's fine. Thank you so much. Make yourself comfortable. Okay. Sure. <laughs> I'll do it to show you. No, it's okay. Are you enjoying your drink? Sure. I was asking her. Oh, we are. Ah. <laughs> um, can you just move up a bit? Oh. I'd like to sit in your yeah. train. <laughs> Sorry. You okay? Mm -hmm. right. How are you? Good. Your skin is so flawless. Thank you. Mm. Uh, I love you. Don't you love me? Won't you say you love me? <laughs> Won't you say you love me too? <laughs> um. Uh, uh, you know. Let's go to the bedroom. Why? I'd like to show you something really, really important. Come, come here. Let's go. Mm. Keith. Uh, am I the only one that will finish all this? I mean, yeah, 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 sure. You can help yourself, make yourself comfortable. Enjoy I'll... yourself, girlfriend. Yeah, I'll be right well back. said, girl. Telling 
is making love to her probably. Yeah. He just invited her home to enjoy the woman in her. You sure have a great taste, Muffy. I know, but she was hell-bent on coming with me. Even when I asked her to stay back that the date is just for two, she just wouldn't listen. I did, trust me, I did, but she insisted on coming with me. Um, I understand what you're getting at, but Brenda will not do what you, what your mind is telling you. She only told me she wants to follow me so that, you know, maybe one of your friends might see her and like her. Really? Wow. You've already told them about me? <laughs> Is she beautiful? Oh, Murphy, stop. I can't do this. I just can't. Muffy, you really have to stop this right now. Stop! Like letting you go, you know. But I have to go. Mm. You call me when you get home. Sure, I will. <laughs> I love you. I love you more. Another hug. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, uh, you call me when you get home, right? I will call you. Yeah, another hug. Now I have to go. Yeah. All right, take care. You too. All right. Thank you. Call me when you get home. I sure will. All right. Babe, right. let's go. Sure. What's your apple? Is your guy in? Uh, yes, see in the inside. Okay. You saw us leave not quite long. And uh, that's a cool surprise. Yes, I forgot my phone when I came with my friend. Yeah. Uh, oh, which one? Uh, iPhone? Yes. Uh, my head oh, 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 don't worry. You, you, I, I, I'm not even sure where I kept it, but uh, just, yes. Oh, yeah, now go fine. I'm going to collect you, your phone. You. Uh, no problem. Hey, yeah. Ah, sorry. Chai. Ah, just forget for.
Hold on. Hold on. You came back. Oh, yes. I had to. Why? There will be a very big problem if I don't stop this. Stop what? Murphy, I want you to know that I got your back. You got my back how? Same way I will not allow my brother to make a mistake that will mar his life. The same way I know what you do it. Juliet is a facade. She's not who you think she is. What about her? <laughs> First and foremost, Juliet is engaged to a man who saw her through her university education. Secondly, they plan on getting married this festive season. That's not all though. To crown it all, she is one month pregnant for her husband to be. Juliet. She's one month pregnant. If you doubt me, confront her and watch her bury her face in shame. But Juliet can't do this to me. Mm. She told me in confidence that she wants to marry a Yankee husband. So for that reason, she has decided to dump the poor guy and marry you with the pregnancy. Because you told us you came back from Canada. So she wants to dump her husband to be because of me? <laughs> you don't know Juliet. You don't know her. She is so desperate. Look, when you told us, or rather her, and you called her that you were in front of the gates, <laughs> she quickly removed her engagement ring and put it in her handbag. I said to myself, no. No. I cannot watch this innocent young man go through what he wants to get himself into with the fake girl. The one who's close to you may be the one to betray you. This world now, oh, 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 oh. this world now. I must thank you for saving me from this emotional blackmail. You're welcome. You know, I honestly didn't know you were this nice. I was carried away by her false humility. I'm a very good girl, Lou. A very, very good girl. She refused to give you this. How, how did you know she declined? She has a loud mouth. She told me. The one who's close to you may be the one to betray you. This world now, oh, 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 oh. this world now, finish it. Chai, mama, there is a whatever she can do. Oh, 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 Ten times of it. Mr. Man, shine your eyes. Try me. There's more to it than meets the eyes. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize that you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, Google, you have been deceived. Before you jump in. She can't, she can't see this one now, eh? Please, please, please tell me, say she can't call her phone. Say she forget the phone. 
Since we shall enter our house, never come out without food. Wait, to check it. Wait. Oh, oh. She, I see the way she they give our guy one kind eye. But did they to read this guy since? Wait. Eh. Hey, she can't use for more. Say she can't collect food. Since now the phone she they collect. She they collect food. Eh. I see. She did collect food. I came to collect my phone. Now she can collect so. This is good. Then she come here at close gate too. You are so sweet. Oh boy. Did you enjoy it? Of course I did. You're the mm. best thing I've had <laughs> in such a long time. I told you. Mm. And you've got some really sweet sugar cane in between. <laughs> You can say that again. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I want more. I want you to remain inside of me. Huh? You said what? I said I want more. You want more? Mm-hmm. Uh, but we, we just had sex. We did it two times. Yeah, but I want I want more. I can't get enough. After can, two rounds. I can go on and on and on. Wait, wait, okay, wait. After two rounds. Hey. Huh? I can eat you the whole of the day. I can have you every second. That's how sweet you are. Wait, wait. You know what? Can I get some rest? We can continue later. Please. Uh, okay, just take it easy, gradual. I, I, don't use energy. No, you don't understand. Let, let me get some. I'm sweating. Huh? Okay, let me just be on top. Don't. Hey, Mr. Man, shine your eyes. There's more to it than meets the eyes If you're not careful, you'll soon realize That you have been the same Babe You're awake Yes, I'm awake Well, you dozed off after three good rounds Well, I exhausted my energy, so I slept off, yeah I know I had to let you sleep so you can gather enough energy for the task ahead. What task, please? We're going to have it all night long. <laughs> Listen, don't you ever get tired? Oh, come on. How can I get tired when I'm with a cute guy like you? I'm flattered. Oh, you know I'm not flattering you. You are super cute. Thanks for the compliment. Brenda, I'm very hungry. I need to eat something so I can go to bed. I'm on it already. Make it fast. Mm-hmm. You don't have the Coming for you. This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. <laughs> Another person you have Oh my word. <laughs> Juliet will be so shocked. She can never have you whilst I'm still alive. <laughs> Before she knows it, I am Mrs. Muffy. <laughs> she can have this one for all I care. I'm going to marry Muffy. Coming out at last Hey, what did she do to you? <laughs> Another person you have Oh my word! <laughs> Juliet will be so shocked when she sees this. You want to take her place. She can never have you, you her in shape. whilst I'm still alive. <laughs> For you it's just a race. <laughs> Before she knows it, I am Mrs. Muffy. <laughs> she can have this one for all I care. I'm going to marry Muffy. Of coming out at last. Hey, what did she do to you? 
Nice. I'm glad you like it. Mm -hmm. Very nice. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. <laughs> you know, I've been meaning to ask you. Tell me about yourself. <laughs> mm, there's nothing much about me. I'm a graduate. I studied accountancy. I'm from a family of five. My parents and my two siblings. They're identical. Identical twins. Oh. Your mother has twins? Yes. Oh, great. So, you're likely to have twins in the future? Mm, that's what they said. I like twins. Really? Yes, I do. Tell me about your boyfriend. He broke up. Why? I can't continue to date a cheat. Was he cheating on you? Yes. No. With one girl from a rich home. And that's broke me down. I'm sorry about that. You see, um, I really do care about you. And honestly, I'm not looking for a girlfriend. I'm looking for a wife. And if you agree to be my wife, I promise to, I promise to treat you like a queen and, um, uh, Make up for everything bad he did to you. Just say yes, that's all. That's all you have to say. A mistake that you regret because nobody knows who is who, who is for you or against you. I'm a I don't know why this man is always sitting up like that. Normally, a man has a company chair that invites you to the home. He doesn't like the other ones. Is it because I allow you to oppress me? Is that not my position? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> is this all this is about? <laughs> the man likes a particular That's chair. That? Mom? Mm -hmm. You mean. Morphe called you people that he has found a wife? He said her name is Juliet. Juliet? Did he tell you where she's from? No, but she said she's beautiful and a wife material. And he told me in confidence that he has already proposed to her and she said yes. I can't wait to see her. They're actually coming over the weekend according to him when he called. They're coming to have lunch with us. This weekend? So that means we can meet her. This weekend? Mm -hmm. That means I'm not going anywhere this weekend. I'll stay right back and see my brother's wife to be. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. And um, from the way he sounded, the wife must be very beautiful. Just like your mom when I first met her. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Now, I mean, what does that mean? Does it mean I'm no longer beautiful or what? Did they say anything like that? Come on. But well, that's exactly what it means. Come on, mom. When you, when you were beautiful. Hey, mom, mom. And you said she's as beautiful as your mother. Mom? Come, come on, mom. You're not going to win this one. Dad never said you've lost that beauty that makes you to get attracted to him. Yes. Well, thank God I have a son who will always stand by me. <laughs> Did I say anything like that? Dad, you know I always stand by you. And I sense conspiracy here. You two are ganging up against me. Come on. Hey, no way. Harold. Come on. This your mom will kill me one day. Oh. Eh? Just... Out of jealousy. Okay, you are very beautiful. Come on, mom. Why are you talking like that? <laughs> okay, you know what? You are the most beautiful woman on the planet Earth. Afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> this is not your place. 
You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your lies and deceit. Because you want to take her place, you put her uh -huh. in shame and disgrace. For you, it's just the race. So you want to win this race I should be asking you that so you dropped from Keke just to come and be with Murphy is that what you did This thing here, I never knew she's actually more shameless than I thought. She has no shame, more. no single shame at all. How could you? You left the guy who took care of you. You literally bit the fingers that fed you. And you tried to cajole me into getting married to you. What were you thinking? What were you thinking? Hey, you pig. Is this a cheap lie you told just to be with him? Juliet. Are you not one month pregnant for your fiance? Hmm? Are you not? What is going on here? How do you expect me to just sit by, fold my arms, and watch you deceive an innocent man into marrying a girl like you? Brenda, me, Juliet, pregnant. For who, if I may ask? Brenda, is this how cheap and useless you are? Oh my goodness. Baby, I'm sure you don't expect this low life to own up. After being exposed. So, Brenda, you carried your stupid body back to this place to lie against me so you can live with him. I am ashamed of you. Brenda, you are so lucky. You can say that again. See, guys, make love. No, 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 he wanted to, but I declined. Wait, he asked you to have sex with me, he said no? Yes, I mean, I don't have to. And because I said no, he not said that I'm not a woman of easy virtue. Wow. You know, actually, I can't just watch only you get married. I can't. Maybe it's not in my luck to get married to a Yankee guy. What are you trying to do? Julie, I'm not even happy with you. Why? Like, you, you got a diamond ring and you took off your necklace. Well, who does that? You can compare that chain I was wearing with this. Girl, this is diamond. <laughs> Driver, please take. Driver, <laughs> For... give her back her money. I'm going to pay. For the both of us, eh? Okay. Yeah. Don't worry. I got you, girl. See you back home. Right. Be nice to this moment. Of course I will, girl. Be nice to this moment. I really want this right now. Okay. Bye, bye, me. So this is it. This is the reason why you came back so you can have him. Have you gotten enough of him already? Mm -mm. You should be ashamed of yourself. You have no heart. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now what? Now wow for some girls so 
They really are shameless. Mm. What is she talking about? Shift. I'm pretty sure you do not believe a thing this fool here said. Come on. You know, we have an unfinished business in the bedroom, right? Mm -hmm. I'm ashamed of you. I'm ashamed to call you my friend. Mm. You've always wanted a Yankee man, right? You have him. I hope you're happy. And as for you, I thought you were classy. I thought you're different, but obviously all men are the same. I regret everything. Everything that I gave to you. My time, my love, my, my trust. Mm -mm. Everything. Why are you spitting on us? You know what? You two are good for each other. You know what? You can as well keep your ring. Use it for I'm out of here. Smell out. Just carry your smelly body out. What did she do to you? A bogini come mereki. For you to treat her this way. Don't forget that one day you will pay. What did she do to you? A bogini. My son, Ike Naya, my first strength. Yes, Dad. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you, Dad. Muffy, good to have you home. Thank you, Mom. Muffy? Mom? Is this the Juliet you said you would come over for lunch with? Oh, yes, absolutely. Lie. Mom? Dad? Have you forgotten her? I have been trying to see her well, but she's been hiding her face. I don't know why. This is Brenda, Desmond fiance. Uh, I've not really met her with Desmond like that. He brought her here one or two times like that. So I don't know. Yeah, uh, are you Brenda or Juliet? <sighs> no, who are you? Mom, she's the one I want to marry. They are engaged to get married. Brenda, so you have plans of leaving Desmond for my brother after everything he did for you. He sponsored your education to the level that you are today. Hey, Brenda or Juliet, I don't know which one to call you. If you know what you have done to my son to bewitch him, lose him and let him go. Set him free! You heard her. You are not welcome in this house. You are not welcome. You belong to Desmond. Um, Murphy. Could you please explain to me what exactly is going on here? Mr. Man, shine your eyes. Shine your eyes, shine There's your more eyes. to it than meets the eyes. There's more. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize you're that you have been the sea. Brenda, what do you think you're doing? This month, I am no longer interested in being your wife. I have moved on with a better man. What? W why? Too many questions at the same time. Okay. I'll be precise. Listen, I... I'm no longer interested. I, you're saying you're walking away after everything? I knew this was exactly what you're going to say. Listen, I am grateful for everything you did for me. But I... 
I, I, I just can't do this anymore. I'm sorry. Sorry for what? You are sorry for what? For walking away on a seven years relationship? Brenda, we would have been married by now. Even have kids. Now you're here to tell me you're sorry. You told me you pleaded that you wanted to go to the university. I went through thick and thin to make sure you, 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 you graduated. Now you're here to tell me you're sorry. Brenda. Like I said a million times, I appreciate everything. But there's this guy that came back from Canada and he has asked my hand in marriage. And I said, yes. Brenda, so you, you, you want to marry Morphe, isn't it? Yes, he's the one my heart beats for. Brenda, you're telling me this to my face. You're telling me this to my face, like, after, after seven years. My kids. After seven years. The one who's close to you. May be the one oh, Jesus. to betray you. This world now, oh, 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 oh. this world now, Chai, I'm under the sea. What? Why are you staring at me that way? Because you're beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I want to grow old with you. Okay. What does that mean? I'll marry you. Serious? Mm -hmm. You marry me? I've always made up my mind to marry you and give you beautiful children. Oh, come here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Brenda. So, this is true. The information I got is right, Brenda. Desmond! What are you doing here? You're yelling at me, Brenda. Why won't I yell at you? Wait, after I caught you in bed, pants down with another girl, you have the audacity to show your face here? Brenda, after everything I did for you, you are cheating on me with Murphy. Wait, you know me? Brenda. You won't get away with this, I promise you. Cheat! Cheat, go! Hey, that guy called my name. Does he know me? He's the Desmond I told you about. Oh. Um, my brother's friend. So, what is your meaning now is my ring? Yeah, sure. Good evening, girls. Hey, Harold. What's up, man? I'm good. You good? Yeah, I'm good. Girls. Yeah. Were you with Brenda this afternoon? Yes, I was. Is there a problem? Whatever you have with that girl, you need to kill it. You remember what we told you the other time you brought her to the house? She belongs to Despot, my friend. I don't care. Did I hear you right? Girls. Yeah. Did I hear you right? Mm -hmm. You can't do this to a fellow man like you. Why? That guy trained her in school. And they are engaged to get married. But she told me um, they've broken up and uh, she caught him cheating on her. Yeah. She lied. Nothing like that happened. This man is my friend and is planning to get married to her this festive period. And she consented to you too. Yes. 
I'm going to get married to her because she's the one for me. You can't get married to her. She belongs to Desmond. No, she belongs to me. No, that's not right. Well, I believe she's old enough to make decisions for herself. Yes. Girls, Desmond trained that woman to suit what he wants, allow him to be with his wife. Well, like I said, she is old enough to make decisions for herself. And at this point, she has made a choice, and that's fine. She chose me. Are you going to fight that? Because what are you even doing? Yeah, but she's, she's made her decision, and she but likes this me. Is, this is not right. It's not right. You need to kill it, please. Stop this. So man, shine your eyes. Shine your eyes. Shine There's more eyes. to it than meets the eyes. More. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize that you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Okay, uh, good afternoon, sir. Yeah? Uh, again, Mr. wants to see you. One guy. Wants to see me? Yes, sir. What for? Uh, um, I don't know. In the gate, he say he wants to see you. Okay, here. Check the oil gauge of this car. Uh, this a man, shine your eyes, shine your eyes, shine There's more to it than meets the eyes of more. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize that you have been deceived. You have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, you. Tell him to come. What? Yeah. Please clean the car for me. I'm coming. You. Yes, it's me. Listen, let me tell you. I will keep having conflicts with you if you do not leave my wife alone. She's not your wife. If you... Something is wrong with you. Do you know that that woman is everything I have on this planet Earth? Can you just leave her alone for me? So I was told you uh, took care of her until she graduated from school. Listen, I'm ready to pay you back, all right? I can give you 20 million naira for you to stay away from her. I can do that. If not that I have a good relationship with your brother, I would have descended on you right now. You know, you're very stupid. Just leave her alone. No. You, you, wait, you think I'm that poor? If you just mentioned 20 million, I will, I will start dancing. I'll marry her You're and crazy. nothing will happen. You marry her nothing will happen? I'll marry her and nothing will happen. Think about the money. I love her so much. I want to spend the rest of my life with her. I was serious. He should name his price. I'm ready to pay anything. I'm ready to pay him off. I can't let Brenda go. She's the one for me. This world now you don't really know who is who you don't know who is for you or oh, against you I'm on the one you trust so much maybe Hi hey babe Yeah I just stepped in how are you That's okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll be expecting you. All right, bye. Wait. You mean he came here after what he did to me? He asked me to leave his wife. Who's his wife? Me? I can never be his wife. I'm not his wife. Oh. Tell me what I need to know. 
Did he really cheat on you? B. Of course he did. <clears throat> were you not there when I confronted him and he couldn't look me in the face to deny it? You are there now. Why is he making a fuss about everything? Well, maybe his so-called daughter of a rich man has jilted him and he wants to use his own to spoil mine. I offered him 20 million naira. After he bragged that he paid your university fees. I, I, I mean, don't... Wait. Don't blame me. Listen, I wanted to pay him off. Morphe. I wanted to pay him off, but he insisted I must stay away from his wife. Can you see the level of his madness? When did Desmond marry me? See, my love, if you doubt me, go to my father's house and figure out things yourself. I'm not his wife, fool. I'm not his wife, fool. I'm not. There's a man shine your eyes. Shine your eyes. There's more to it than makes the eyes fall. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize I'm actually on a hot seat right now and the truth is I really want to get married to you because I feel you have all it takes to give me twins I want twin babies when I get married to you you're going to give me twins right Make love to me. What? Make love to you? Yes. But we're not married. Babe. Huh? It's my ovulation period. And once your semen goes inside of me and comes together with my eggs, then we'll share of conception. Um, I don't understand. Like I said, I am in my ovulation. And each time I ovulate, I produce two eggs. Oh, two eggs? Mm -hmm. Does that mean twins? Exactly my point. Oh, two eggs become twins. Mm -hmm. Is that how it works? Yes. Oh, so we should... Uh, okay, so let's let's make up so that we can produce two eggs. Yes. Are you not sure of yourself? How? Except your semen is weak or low for fertilization. No, come on, no, no. I'm I'm perfectly fine. I mean, I'm hundred percent okay. And we have it, twin boys. Twin boys. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Twin boys. Mm -hmm. Yeah. My brother is hell bent on marrying Brenda, even after my parents threatened not to give them their blessings. Murphy is joking with fire. I will deal with him. He can't marry Brenda. He even told us that he offered you 20 million naira, but you bluffed. Yes. If he likes, let him offer me 500 million naira. I don't care. I cannot trade Brenda with anything in the world. Are you aware that the marriage is Saturday? Murphy. I'm going to do something terrible, honestly. Any marriage built on bedrock of lies can never, ever stand the taste of time. Yes, that's true. But Juliet, can you tell us what happened? <laughs> the truth is that I'm depressed. I can't even talk. <laughs> yes, I know. Can you just tell us what, what transpired? Come on. 
It all started the day Brenda and I were together and Murphy stopped us. You know my Yankee guys are in town this festive season. I know. My eye they chuko. <laughs> Brenda, huh? this month is there. Don't forget. Okay. What's that? What's that now? <laughs> I hope it's not what I'm thinking. Brenda. What are these keke guys? What are you thinking? Hi, ladies. Hi. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, my name is Murphy. My name is Brenda. Oh, nice name. What about you? I'm Juliet. Oh, nice name. Can I call you Julie? It's okay, sir. Oh, you're, you're beautiful, you know? You see, I'm not really into light-skinned women, but uh, I, I like your calves. You, you look really cool. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Where, where are you guys headed? <laughs> We're going to the salon to get our hair done. Oh, great. C can I drop you guys off? Sure, why not? All right, hop in, let's go. Even when I was doing everything to make her comfortable and happy, she was lost in it after another man. My brother was initially interested in Juliet here. Yes. He even told my parents that he's bringing his fiancée to the house. To our greatest surprise, he brought Brenda to the house claiming she's Juliet. What? He never knew I know Brenda very well. So, how was she able to convince Murphy to marry her? How was she be able to, to, to win his heart? I told you I don't want him anymore. I had no water in my mouth when I said that to you. Brenda, you're always all over this guy before. What happened? What changed? My love for him died. Like dead and buried. What part of English do you not understand? Huh? Hi, Juliet, friend. tell me, what has Desmond done that no man has ever done for anybody before? What's, what's all this about? Desmond, Desmond, Desmond. What has he really done? You know exactly what I'm talking about and I'm sure you know what you're doing. Of course. I like the sound of that. I know what I am doing. <laughs> okay. So, girl, does that mean that I can come? Let me get dressed. <laughs> Which time will have me this one? Don't tell me you're serious. Of course I am dead serious. Forget this month. I feel I am done. Like, your babes is done. Done for good. Don't leave this guy heartbroken. Don't leave him messed up. This guy loves you, you know. <laughs> My sister, breakfast is for everybody. Now, when you reach your turn, you chop down, drink water, clean mouth. Let me get dressed. Babes, is he still going to come? I mean, you can never take this guy seriously. He gave me his words, so he's definitely going to come. <laughs> but you've been waiting for over an hour now. Or are you going to wait indefinitely? 
Brenda, it's obvious something is keeping him. Besides, I'm already waiting for him. You're right. But it's just that we both know what those guys of nowadays are capable of doing. Who knows if he's with one girl smooshing and making out with her and keeping you here waiting. You know, you can never trust these guys. Let me be the one to bother myself with that. Yeah. So where is he taking you to? His house or a five-star restaurant or hotel? None of that. He said he wants me to come know his place. Wow! Yes. Let's let me come with you now. No, Brenda. It's a date for two. You can come with me. But girl, see, you never can tell. Maybe one or two of these guys that came back from overseas with him might be around and might find me attractive. <laughs> you want a Yankee man? What then yeah. happens to that smart? What about him? <sighs> Must you bring him into a conversation? Yes, because it's important. Brenda. Yeah, girl. Why are you going dressed like this? How? There's nothing wrong with what I'm wearing. Everything is wrong with what you are wearing. Girl, your boobs is almost out. It's just that Murphy's friends might be there. So I'm trying to dress to kill to actually the kind of man I want. Oh, really? You're going to Murphy's house to sell a market? Huh? Brother, please, I don't like this. I don't like this. What? What is your plan? I like what I'm wearing. I don't like it. And I'm sure Movie won't buy this. This is so revealing now. Yo, come on. This is my date, not yours. Hope you know that. I can still grab one or two. Hope you know that. Yo, please now. Not do me like this. I don't want this guy to see me like one of those cheap girls or a lose one. This is Hong Kong. I don't know. I'm good. How are you? Of course, I'm all dressed. Really? I will be out soon. Is he? Yes. No, I have to wait for you. Sorry. What was that for? Juliet, don't just start. The question is, why did you do that? Baby, it's simple. I do not want this engagement ring to be bad market for me. You know the vibe now. Oh, so you now have a product that you want to go to Morphe's house to sell? Brenda, please, I beg you in the name of God. I do not want this guy to see me like a cheap girl or one of those loose girls. <sighs> Babe, he's waiting. Let's just go have fun and let's go. Girlfriend, I hope you do not have any plan of snatching Murphy away from me. My goodness. How can you say such a thing to me? Because I don't understand this whole drama you are performing. I don't. And I know you did not want me to follow, but I must. Let's go. I don't trust you, and I have my eyes on you. No problem. Hi. Hi. Man, shine your eyes. There's more to it.
Wisdom meets the eyes If you're not careful You'll soon realize That you have been You like it? I love it! Oh, you great. sure have a great taste. Oh, yes. Thank you very much. Let's go, please. Come. Oh. Wow! He's showering her with lots of love already. Hmm. Obviously, I am. I mean, your place is so beautiful. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, please make yourself comfortable. I'll get you something to drink. What, what, what would you want? Sorry. Um, anything soft. Anything soft. I'll get you something soft. Make yourself comfortable, right? Okay. Are you not so lucky to attract such a man? Did you say lucky? Girl, the universe has blessed me. Hey! God! This is something I never prayed for. Babe, where are his friends now? One or two guys around. Let me see if I can. Friends. Get one person. Are you blind? Can't you see it doesn't have any? There's no one in this house. This is uh, all I could find. Uh, this is all I could find. It's fine. Thank you so much. Make yourself comfortable. Okay. Sure. <laughs> I'll do it to show you. Sorry, kept you waiting. No, it's okay. Are you enjoying your drink? Sure. I was asking her. Oh, hi. Ah. <laughs> um, can you just move up a bit? Oh. I'd like to sit in the yeah. train. Sorry. You okay? Mm -hmm. right. How are you? Your skin is so flawless. Thank you. Mm. I love you. Don't you love me? 
would you say you love me? <laughs> would you say you love me too? <laughs> um, uh, uh, you know, let's go to the bedroom. Why? I'd like to show you something really, really important. Come, come here, let's go. Keith? Uh, am I the only one that will finish all this? I mean, yeah, 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 sure. You can help yourself, make yourself comfortable. Enjoy yourself, girlfriend. Yeah, I'll be right well back. Said girl. There's a world in our You don't really know who is who. You don't know who is for you. Oh, I guess you, Amanda Neze. The one you trust so much may be the one to hurt you, child. The one who's close to you may be the one to betray you. There's a world now. They've been gone for some minutes now. What could he be telling her? Oh. He's making love to her, probably. Man. He just invited her home to enjoy the woman in her. You sure have a great taste, Muffy. I know, but she was hell-bent on coming with me. Even when I asked her to stay back that the date is just for two, she just wouldn't listen. I did, trust me, I did, but she insisted on coming with me. Um, I understand what you're getting at, but Brenda will not do what, you, what your mind is telling you. She only told me she wants to follow me so that, you know, maybe one of your friends might see her and like her. Really? Wow. You've already told them about me? <laughs> Is she beautiful? Oh, Murphy, stop. I can't do this. I just can't. Muffy, you really have to stop this right now. Stop! letting you go, you know. But I have to go. Mm. You call me when you get home? Sure, I will. <laughs> I love you. I love you more. Another hug. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, uh, you call me when you get home, right? I will call you. Yeah, another hug. Now I have to go. Yeah. Alright, take care. You too. Right. Thank you. Call me when you get home. I sure will. Yeah, Alright. Babes, let's go. Sure. Diamonds. I'm so happy. This is so beautiful. Diamond. Yeah. Girls and diamonds. I will love diamonds a lot. <laughs> so happy for you. Thank you. I got here, here, here. 
What are you trying to do? Chili, I'm not even happy with you. Why? Like, you, you got a diamond ring and you took off your necklace. Well, who does that? You can compare that chain I was wearing with this. Girl, this is diamond. <laughs> Driver, please take. Driver, <laughs> for... give her back her money. I'm going to pay. For the both of us, eh? Okay. Yeah. Don't worry. I got you, girl. See you back home. Right. Be nice to Desmo. Of course I will, girl. Be nice to Desmo. I will. I really want this right now. Okay. This is not your place You shouldn't be here in the first place Another person you have replaced With your lies and deceit Because you want to take her place You put her uh -huh. in shame For you is just the race. What are you doing here? Hey, you want to win this race. I should be asking you that. So you dropped from Keke just to come and be with Murphy. Is that what you did? Because the truth has a way of coming out at last. Hey, what did she do to you? Oh, baby. This thing here, I never knew she's actually more shameless than I thought. She has no shame, more. no single shame at all. How could you? You left the guy who took care of you. You literally bit the fingers that fed you. And you tried to cajole me into getting married to you. What were you thinking? What were you thinking? Hey, you pig. Is this a cheap lie you told just to be with him? Juliet. Are you not one month pregnant for your fiance? Hmm? Are you not? What is going on here? How do you expect me to just sit by, fold my arms, and watch you deceive an innocent man into marrying a girl like you? Brenda, me, Juliet, pregnant. For who, if I may ask? Brenda, is this how cheap and useless you are? Oh my goodness. Baby, I'm sure you don't expect this low life to own up after being exposed. So Brenda, you carried your stupid body back to this place to lie against me so you can live with them. I am ashamed of you. Hey. Hey. So this is it. This is the reason why you came back so you can have him. Have you gotten enough of him already? Mm -mm. You should be ashamed of yourself. You have no heart. <laughs> oh my god. Now what? Now wow for some girls so they really are shameless. Mm. What is she talking about? Shift! I'm pretty sure you do not believe a thing this fool here said. Come on. You know, we have an unfinished business in the bedroom, right? Hmm? I'm ashamed of you. I'm ashamed to call you my friend. Mm. You've always wanted a Yankee man, right? You have him. I hope you're happy. And as for you, I thought you were classy. 
I thought you were different, but obviously all men are the same. I regret everything. Everything that I gave to you. My time, my love, my, my trust. Mm -mm. Everything. Why are you spitting on us? You know what? You two were good for each other. You know what? You can as well keep your ring. Use it for I'm out of it. Smell out. Just carry your smelly body out. What did she do to you? A bogini come for you to treat her this way. Don't forget that one day. Juliet, I blame you for all this. So all this was happening and you couldn't tell me. You know, I blame myself. I blame myself for all of this. I saw it so clearly, but I should have known that she has an ulterior motive. I just blame myself and all I want right now is my Murphy back. I've, I've lost my Brenda, a woman I invested so much in. I'm so sorry for both of your losses. Well, this should have been averted. Juliet, I, I think you didn't do enough. I didn't do enough, but I want Murphy back. I want my man back. She, she, she can't just have Murphy. I want my woman back. So, so how, how are you going to go about this to, to bring them back? I'm sorry you lost them both. Could it be that she used charms on him? She used no charm. It was all lies upon lies. She kept telling the lies until Murphy starts seeing me as a piece of trash. That's what she did. She's so good at telling lies and, and it worked for her this period. So sad. So sad. I just want my Murphy back. I want Murphy back. That's all I want. That's all I want. That's just all I want. <laughs> What? My love. <laughs> I'm so happy our wedding is done and dusted. I'm the happiest man in the world right now. <laughs> <laughs> I was so surprised seeing your people in attendance. After threatening they were not going to come for our wedding. I was very surprised too. Honestly. The most important thing is our marriage is official. And I won, finally. <laughs> I won. This world now, you don't really know who is who. You don't know who is for you or against you. I'm undone, The one you trust so much may be the one to hurt you, child. One who's close to you may be the one to betray you. Agatha, <sighs> madam, after that, he said, Push this out. Fetch my husband. Hmm? Fetch my husband. Okay, madam. Come in. 
Okay. I heard you, you can leave. I don't care, I'm saying they come in, they wear clothes. What? You saw him naked? No. Ah. ah. Madam, as I reach through my knock, he didn't say make I come oh, in. Wait, wait, wait. Which part of his body did you see? Madam, I don't understand the room. You entered my room without knocking. No, I I knock. He say come in. I come in not to know. I swear. I'm not saying it's no, not to know. Get out. Uh, ma Madam, I'm not saying it's no. I just enter your room here. Yeah. I'm not saying Get out of my sight! Thank you, ma. Thank you. Thank you. This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your lies and deceit. Because you want to take her place You put her in shame and disgrace For you it's just a race hey, You want to win this race Now that you have won the race How long do you think it will last? Because the truth has a way Jonathan, what are you doing? Okay, uh, I've been there. I don't close. I go to church on Sunday. Do you go to church? Yes, sir. I thought you were Muslim. Ah, no, I be Jonathan, Christian. Oh, okay. Open the gate. Oh. Mr. Man, shine your eyes. There's more to it than meets the eyes. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize. I can't believe this. What is going on? My husband did not take his breakfast before going to work. And I noticed he did not respond to my greeting this morning. Is there something going on in this house that I don't know? Agatha! Agatha! Yes, ma! Come back here. Ma. My husband did not take his breakfast before going to the office. Do you have any explanation to that? I don't understand me. You don't understand? Eh? What don't you understand? I'm asking you. Ma, if Ogano eats in breakfast before going for work, uh, maybe he's late for work. Uh, not be bad thing now. Not be today he won't go work without eating. My husband took one hour to get dressed for work, but could not spare 10 minutes to take his breakfast. <laughs> Agatha, I know why I'm asking you this. Do you have anything with my husband? Mokolo. Shut up, Asami! Ah. 
Madame, me, I no understand this kind of question, no. Eh? If if you and Muga get more panta for house, we just carry carry everything like like this. Come put on top of this my small head now. I no good. You say make I go call Oga for a room. I I go there I knock. And you open I enter I call him. Agata, ma. <laughs> What are you wearing in my house? Okay, the clothes, why are you buying for markets? Agatha. Huh? What are you wearing in my house? Clothes. Agatha. Huh? <laughs> Agatha. Are you having something with my husband? No, ma'am. Ma'am, uh, I don't have anything to go. How uh, are you? Ma, what to know? Vanish! Yeah? Get out! Ma, not to know, not to know. Not anything. What to know, see? Come on, keep us with you. What's in What's in oh. You see this thing you're wearing? Let me not see this kind of nakedness in my house again. My nakedness like this. And along Is to... this are you wearing anything here? Are you wearing anything here? <laughs> not to make it. I will get up. Stupid thing. She wants to seduce my husband because she feels her breast is bigger than my own. No sense. Jonathan Fu, early this morning. Mm, fool. Me, Jonathan, a fool. Which can we have like this? Eh? What kind of woman is this now? I'm not wishing her, her husband gets a, a small quanta. She's in Agatha. What did Agatha come do for this matter now? If you forgot no green eats food, Nagata. You forgot, you forgot no green sleep for, for, for bed. Nagata, she will come meet, come blame me, say na me. This one will go find within the two hours. I'll be Agatha. I'll come for my number, not do anybody anything. No. Ah, I'll get my own problem. I don't come this as a back on the here, I got this, I got that. I come here, come make me new. You should not go come carry her problem put for my head. They have the big distance. So simply because I confronted Morphe last night. You did not respond to my greetings this morning. And he also refused to take his breakfast. Hey. 
Hey, babe, stop. Babe, listen. I need to get some rest. I had a long day at work, please. Babe. What? You can't keep doing this every night. <sighs> come on. You know I always come back drained from work. Babe, you don't let me enjoy my husband as I should. <sighs> because of work. I'm tired. And why are you making this look like I'm being difficult? I, I'm just tired. I, I need to get some sleep. Please. Why do you keep doing this? What about me? I also work. People, we just had sex. I just once. This is not food, you know? Babe, you are going to make love to me to my satisfaction. I, I, I'm just tired. Listen, we can do this some other time, please. Stop! Babe, you are going to make love to me. More than once. As much as I wanted. That's why you're my husband. Okay, I need to get some rest. Babe? Where are you going? I just left the room again because I asked for sex. We shall see. This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your lies and deceit. Because you want to take her place, you put her in shame and disgrace. For you, it's just a race. Hey, you want to win this race. Now that you have won the race, how long do you think it will last? I can't believe Morphe left this room this night again for me. Why does he keep running away from his problems? This is three years of marriage. No child. Talk about it. Next thing he will leave the room with a pillow and come back the next morning. To where exactly? What is up to hey, what did she do to you? A bogini come for you to treat her this way. Don't forget that one day you will pay. What did she do to you? A bogini come for you to treat her this way, don't forget that one. Where has he gone to? He's not even here. Where in God's name did he go? He can't just disappear into thin air just like that. He's not even here. Where on earth could he have gone by this time of the night? I just hope he's not what I am thinking. Could he be that he's in this stupid mid room? Hey, what did she do to you? A bogini come for you to treat her this way. Don't forget that one day you will pay. What did she do to you? A bogini come for you to treat her this way. Don't forget that one day you will pay. Now that you've achieved your aim, what is really 
your game. After you have put her through pain and shame. Oh, what a shame. Off he keeps leaving the room each time I ask for sex. Is there something going on in this house that I do not know of? My husband just disappeared into thin air for nothing. I cannot sit inside water and allow soap enter my life. No problem. I know what to do. Where have you been? I can't be asking you questions and you are acting like I'm talking to myself. Where have you been? Murphy, I hope you know what I'm thinking. Aren't you possible, Brenda? Did you just ask me that question? That a man leaves his bedroom each time the wife demands that he sleeps with her. He runs away. Murphy, it's been three years of our marriage. No child. People are beginning to talk. You don't know. People are actually beginning to talk. What's going on? Brenda, we mustn't have sex multiple times before you can get pregnant. One time is enough. Murphy, instead of you to bloat out your wife's tummy, you prefer doing it with the housemaid. What? <laughs> oh, you think I don't know? I know everything. I came downstairs last night to look for you. But you were nowhere to be found. Where did you go? <laughs> you snuck into her room as usual to sleep with her, right? Don't worry. I will catch you both right-handed very, very soon. Brenda, are you in any way suspecting Agatha and I? Deny it. Deny it. Oh, well, I, I know you're going to deny it. What do you men really want? I will catch you both. Don't worry. I will definitely catch you red-handed with her. Keep sneaking into her bedroom every night. I know. I know that he is sleeping with Agatha. Yet, he will still deny it. I just need to catch them red handed. Just imagine. I asked her to go and call my husband for breakfast. She came back and started saying, Eh, Ma, he was wearing his clothes when I got there. He was wearing his clothes when I got there. Yeah, 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 yeah. So she saw him naked. She saw him naked. What is there for him to hide again? There's nothing. He has nothing to hide from her again. No problem. <laughs> there is no way I'm going to share my husband with some dirty, stupid housemaid. Okay. All I just need is a concrete evidence to put them both in their rightful position. Nonsense.
I'm doing good. Yeah, yeah, sure. Good. Alright. What's up? Everything is fine. Trust me. Harold, everything is okay. Everything is fine. Thanks. Hey, Mr. Man, shine your eyes. There's more to it than meets the eyes. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize that you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, Google, you. You have been deceived. Get down. Where is this boy? Okay, welcome, sir. Good afternoon. Where have you been? Huh? Yeah. What are you doing? I, I just log it. Nah, say my concrete. Is my wife around? Yes, my dad inside. Hey, what are you doing? Bring that down. Let's go. Are you okay? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, you are going for carry this one cup. I saw that for village. <laughs> that village girl. So she carry bag for her the entire house. But we do. The girl get shape. You must see her shape. Now V boots. You are going see V boots carry come house. Hmm. Hmm. She's our new maid. Her name is Agatha. She's from Anambra State, right? Yeah, Anambra State. Wait, wait a minute. You mean you went to get a housemaid without me consenting to it? Babe, come on. You know you've been complaining too much. You've been complaining of work stress and uh, I, I, I just had to get her, you know, to help. This is sickening and absurd that my husband went to get a housemaid. Without my consent. Babe, I'm sorry. I, I, I should have told you my plans. I, I didn't know it was going to get you. Murphy, if you want peace in this house, if you want peace to reign in this house, take this thing back to wherever you brought her from. Babe, why, why are you being irrational? If I want a housemaid, I should go get one for myself. Not the other way around. So, she leaves. No, she stays. She leaves. No, she stays. Murphy, I say what happens around here. And this topic is not up for discussion. Where has it ever been done that a man goes to get a housemaid for the house? Where? It surprises me how you understand things sometimes, you know. It's been hard for us in this house. You've been complaining of stress, work stress. 
And I spoke to a friend of mine who introduced me to an agency who made her available. She's a maid. She's going to help us out. She's going to help cook, do the chores and whatnot. Just hear yourself speak. Morphe, just listen to yourself. You went and arranged with someone to get you a housemaid. Bravo. <laughs> Let us clap for him. Odogu, man on fire. Mm. My stance remains that this thing leaves my house this minute. And I mean it. Oga, what did they happen now? Okay, they didn't go back to the No, 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 no. It's all right. Everything is fine. Where's your bag? All right, come with me. Okay, there you go. Here's your room. Feel at home, feel comfortable. Um, I'll get you some food to eat. Thank if you, you need anything, just let me know. Okay? Yes. Uh, um, okay. Yeah? I see my guy tell you, make you know who the um, madam. Oh, my wife. Oh, come on. <laughs> Don't worry, my, my wife can be very funny sometimes. All right, but it's okay. Everything's going to be all right. Okay? Just feel at home, I'll get you something to eat, all right? You can find real weather. But why, madam, the do like say the poor came and prepare for her body? I did not work at the house, can you come? I don't come beside, I don't come. I'm not going anywhere. I don't come. So this is my room. brought into my house. What is wrong with you? Really? I should be asking you that question, Muffy. Brenda, I understand our differences, but I suggest we don't wash our dirty linens outside. Oh, is that what you call this? I didn't tell you because of what previously happened in this house. You remember you threw a kite out of this house. You did the same to Eno. Come on. Brenda, sometimes you get me worried. You complain of fatigue every single day, yet you don't need a house help. Listen, I know why I am doing what I am doing. I do not want to lose my marriage to any of these girls. Really? Yes. I've heard stories of how these girls will come into a woman's house and take her husband from her and then becomes a girl wife. I should have known. So this is what you're up to. After everything we've been through, you still do not trust me. Where's the trust you have for me, Brenda? Mofi, this has nothing to do with trust. Do you get it? This is all about cautiousness. Cautiousness? Really? <laughs> what, what, what kind of caution are you talking about? You see these girls, these so-called housemates, I don't trust them. I learned some of them can be sweet in bed. You're unbelievable. Yeah. You think it's funny? I'm not laughing. I just said you're unbelievable. I am not. I am not. 
I'm not going to let some stupid girl come here and wind her, her nonsense dirty waist on my property. I won't let it happen. Number one, tell me Who gave you my food? Um, I'll go serve you. Are you stupid? Why would my husband serve you food? Did you come here to serve or be served? I'm sorry. I, I come to serve. Follow me! I should. to me. If I see you anywhere, I mean an inch close to my husband, if I by any chance catch you pants down with my husband, I need not tell you what I will do to you. Of course, men looking at me can tell. It's not by having big boobs or big ass. <laughs> Madam. I'm a very nice person though. In my village, they know me as someone like this. Shush it. Shush it. Wash those plates first and go to the backyard and wash the heap of clothes waiting for you there. Did you hear me? Agatha, I, I'm really sorry. The kitchen is messed up. Agatha, okay, so I'm here. Don't worry. I will wash this place eh, and it will be clean. Clean. Thank clean. you very much. Please feel at home, okay? She's here to do housemaid job in my house. <laughs> you see that waist she wants to use to knock my husband? I will shift it one side for her. <laughs> I want the housemaid to wash them. Brenda? Hmm? But these clothes are clean. I personally washed them with the washing machine. 
I want the housemaid to wash them with her hands and not the machine. Hand wash is always better. I don't understand. You want Agatha to wash these clothes. I personally washed myself with the machine. Okay, let me ask you. Do you also want Agatha to wash your underwear? Uh-huh. Yes, now. Why? She is here to do my biddings. Failure to adhere to my instructions. I will kick her out same way I kicked others. Please drop my undies. What is wrong with you? Please, 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 please. Oh. I don't understand. What has come over her? Okay. So she complains about having to do all the house chores after a hectic day at work. And as a good husband that I am, I come in to salvage the situation. And she gets mad at me. Now she wants to kill someone's daughter. She's possessed. Agatha! Where is this useless girl? Agatha! Come and wash these clothes. Agatha! She has to wash them very well. No sense. That's why she came to the house. To work, of course. Come and walk. Agatha! Agatha! Perfect, perfect. Yeah, perfect. I discussed her monthly pay with her and she's fine with it. Listen, she seems like a very hardworking lady to me. Mm, let her do anyhow and see if she won't leave my house. I'll call you back, I'll call you back, please. She seems to you like a very hardworking girl, right? Brenda, you desperately wanted a maid and I got one for you. So why are you making a fuss about it? Are you asking me that? Like seriously? Why am I making a fuss out of it? So Murphy, you did not see any of these very ugly girls to bring. Is that kind of girl? What's wrong with the one I brought? You want to know the truth? Yes. I don't like her. Why? Why? I don't just want that thing in my house. I don't want her. I honestly don't see anything wrong with Agatha. Ah, why will you see? Why will you see you men? You have to go bring a girl that has big breast, big ass, yet don't see anything wrong with it. You've got to assess your taste and then brought her to my house. Nothing wrong with nothing wrong with it. God forgive you. I'll give you two. Take that thing out of my house. Get my eyes on you. Madame never wear this clean clothes. She never wear them now. Why does she say make her wash them? These clothes are clean. Come, Madame, one me kai. Wash all these things. Eh? Let's see me kai wash up. Abina, you know, she don't make a wash up. I go wash up. I get trained. Wait till I come this and come do my to wash. So this clothes won't be anything to me. Wait till I come to this house and wash them. Wash them.
why have you chosen to be a nagging wife? You call me a nagging wife. Just because I I said I don't want that thing in my house. You have changed totally. You're becoming nasty and it irritates me. Call me whatever you want. I do not want that thing in my house. I am going to protect my own at all costs. I honestly don't understand you. Maybe you should go ahead and get the type of maid you want so that this stupid, this nonsense can stop. And you think I've not been trying to talk to these agents to help me get a house made? The same agent that got Ikaite and Eno that you practically threw out of the house because they, they are either pretty or too sexy to be around me. I think you have insecurity problems. Okay, if you let me in the bar side. I don't know. You don't hear me before, now. It's as about Maka. As about Maka, as about Mama. Even you and ye, even ye there, you Maka. You fine. So, what do you mean? Agata. Yeah, Agata. Yeah, I get Mama. I get Mama. If you put it that way. Eh, I come from a far distance, somewhere far. Far. Uh, where, where be that? Uh, do you about Urumba? Urumba. Urumba, Bany, Urumba, Anambra State. Uh -huh. Where is Urumba? In Gunoko. Okay. Ah, I want your Can you imagine? 
She has to rewash these clothes. She has to rewash them. And wash them sparkling clean. Else you leave my house. Just imagine, what is this? Who washes like this? She came into my house to be lazy in about. Next thing now, she'll start opening her two left legs for my husband. I won't let that happen though. That will not happen here. Rubbish. What is this? Who washes like this? Agatha! Agatha! Where is she? Jonah, Jonah. Jonah, Jonah. I'll give mama. I'll give sugar. I give for it. What about your wife and your children? Uh, your pickings? Wife? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Me, I never marry you. Huh? I be like a person don't marry. Old man like you. Huh? How can old man like you never marry? Why now? Me, old man. Be like you know, this black hair, waste you there here, now you see they confuse you. No, no, say you the old man. No, 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 no. You know, no, say you the old man. See? See? Mm. See what I Yes, now. Aggie, I never old though. Eh? Now, condition make the fish bend. You know, say this work, where would they do so? Where would they open gate, they push gate, open gate under this hot sun? If they make person old fast, fast. So I never old. This thing are just. I'm a young and vibrant person inside. Stop deceiving yourself. Stop deceiving yourselves. Stop. Now you never want to marry. You don't old. Uh -huh. Me you don't, don't old? Yes, you be old man. Ah, actually, me I never old though. And if you, maybe they see me for face like this, now I go to say I don't old. Maybe this be a bit deceive you. Inside there, now 18 years I did. Hot blood, fire, okay. 18 years. Yo, I need to wait what now I will carry and lift up to the way. I never old. Jonah, you are an old man. You are an old man. I'm not an old man. You can't make this. I'm not an old man. Huh? Oh yeah, I'm going to tell you. I Okay, but I see be like this now, eh? I see, I understand what you they talk. And I be say, see Oka, see Oko. You want to? Yeah, Oka Oko. Eh, Oko Oko. Oko Oko. Oko Oko. Even Nani Ibo Banyo, even see. Eh? That O, Nibo, the O, started Oko. Oh, yeah, now. I see Niboko. Niboko. But I go, I go marry you. Ah! Eh? Marry who? Give me a squat. Eh? Get an organ. I go marry you. You go marry who? Inge. Me. Uh, you. Agatha. Hey! Do you know why my mama and papa name me Agatha? Eh? No, 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 no. Examine. Examine me. Eh? Do you know why my mama and papa? Name me Agatha. Eh? It's because I am Aki. Ah, Mama. What's one called? Eh? Eh. Aki. Eh. Mama. That's who? Look. Finish. Who took him? Clean out! Who took him again? One marry who? Eh? You want marry who? I won't marry you now. I go no go. Me boko. Mm, other ban. Check out. See? Si. Do you know when I was coming to Asaba, I was making plans? Yes. And when I now entered Asaba and see how beautiful Asaba is, and now vicious, visualized my future. Ooh. I've already planned how I will marry one fine papa. Oh, I... I will now build a big mansion for me. Hey, oh, mommy. As I'm not uh, coming. Uh, uh, we will not we'll work together. Madam. Madam. Agis. Agis. Welcome, Agis, madam. Uh, Welcome, Agis, madam. Uh, Agis, madam. Uh, food uh, is ready. Uh, Agis, madam. Madam, Sagi. Agatha. 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 Old man. This girl, what I'm going to do for you? She don't see me finish you. See me, old man. A whole ex president like me. Yes. The whole street, one, one, in, 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 only me, Jonathan, one. Nobody else, Jonathan. Eh? Even in the Bible, Joseph, he started with TJ. I am the Joseph of Agatha. 
Uh, Agi, hey, uh, the first time I saw this guy for the Panama in love, the guy was swimming in love. <laughs> Listen, how could she even accuse me of having an affair with her maid? How could she do that? Women can be so unpredictable. Like... Why, why am I even bothered? Is she any better? No, she's not. But it's so crazy. How could she... think of such? It doesn't make sense. You are not sounding lively on the phone. I was convinced that you are not alright. <laughs> Brenda is trying to set my house on fire. I don't get it. She has refused to accept Agatha. Again? Yeah. She's making a fuss about it. But why? She says I must employ an ugly looking girl from Abakilike, not a pretty one from Anambra. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I, I get it now. Okay, she's afraid of you ending up in the hands of a beautiful Anambra woman. Is it? It's a sad situation, my brother. <laughs> Fine girls, no pimples. Ah, can just cook this soup fast, fast. Ah, make the love of my life comfortable. So that he will get energy. Ah, and I'm come and do me small, small. Ah, Jonathan, he sabi the thing. Ah, life sweet though, life sweet. Jonathan, now come sweet pass it. Ah. Bye bye. Bros, we practically kicked against you marrying Brenda. Harold, I love her, and you know that. You came back from abroad after schooling. You met Barrister Juliet, who was supposed to be your wife. But Brenda came into the picture and told you a lot of lies about her. That made you to leave Barrister Juliet for her. But honestly, everything she told you was actually about herself. So when we met, um, she confirmed that she was in a relationship, but after a while they broke up. From her story, Juliet was the only person in the relationship. She said she was engaged to some guy who paid for her education. I mean, she lied. Yes, she was actually talking about herself. Are you kidding me? Yes. Juliet wasn't in any relationship by then. Oh. Where is Juliet now? She's a big girl now. She now has her own law firm. She married. Not yet. Hi. Ooh. Eh? What did they keep against my love? She never cook finish. Ah, she can't even be this one. She just they see they cook. 
Oh, no figure it. Me, she just do this thing fast, fast, eh? Ma, good thing, good thing that happened for kids, ma. So how about Desmond? He's still in this town. Very rich now. Really? But wounded and heartbroken. He's trying to get over what you uh, friend that did to him. Is he married? No. He's yet to be married. He loves Brenda so much. I was here. I saw how everything started between them. Maybe I need to go and ask for forgiveness. I mean, on behalf of myself and my wife. Ross, both of you hurt this guy so much. You don't have to go begging alone. Brenda must go with you to beg. She's the center of it all. She my started wife, it all. My wife will go with me. You know that. Listen, I just want to go and apologize to her. I hurt her. I betrayed our love. And I just... I just wish she could forgive me. You know, sometimes I wish I can turn the hands of time. I feel so bad. No point lamenting. It's too late to cry over spilt milk. I warned you. But you never listen. You pay deaf ears to everything I was telling you. Are you now? Are you not teaching me my job? Don't you know that I'm master in? I know now. I, I know because I know because I know say people of Oko. I don't hear say on the woman they do well well. Eh, because my great grandmother is from Oko, and she born nineteen children. I hear say the woman palam palam palam. No me lie here, dear boy. Hey, Age. Eh, he say on a girl say carry this to on a sabidu put for inside book. Now for don't be a barrister, doctors and professors. But I see be like this now so that the wrong one. I should say, make I come wag it and up here. See, I see your mumu rich. Huh? What's your puna? See, I see your mumu rich. See, I slow, intelligent way you be. Uh huh. So, you know, say, our lawyers, the barristers. Mm -hmm. uh, nah, the same thing, nah. Nah, the same thing, ah, eh, ah, eh. I don't want to believe I married a woman meant for another man. She deceived me. Brenda practically told me she broke up with her ex, who she caught cheating. She actually lied against Juliet to have her way with me. <sighs> you know, I actually thought she would give me twins because her mother had twins. Do you need to separate us? 
It hinders marriage to see the light of the day. I'm actually on a hot seat right now. And the truth is, I really want to get married to you because I feel you have all it takes to give me twins. I want twin babies. When I get married to you, you're going to give me twins, right? Make love to me. What? Make love to you? Yes. But we're not married. Babe. Huh? It's my ovulation period. And once your semen goes inside of me and comes together with my eggs, then we're sure of conception. Um, I don't understand. Like I said, I am in my ovulation. And each time I ovulate, I produce two eggs. Oh, two eggs? Mm -hmm. Does that mean twins? Exactly my point. Oh, two eggs become twins. Mm -hmm. Is that how it works? Yes. Oh, so we should... Yes. Uh, okay, so let's let's make up so that we can produce two eggs. Yes. Oh. Are you sure this will work? Are you not sure of yourself? How? Except your semen is weak. Or low for fertilization. No, come on, no, no. I'm, I'm perfectly fine. I mean, I'm 100% okay. And we have it. Twin boys. Twin boys. Yeah. Yeah. Twin boys. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So Brenda and I got together, yeah? And uh, we got intimate. In fact, we were intimate for the whole of that month. And suddenly she says she is pregnant. And I, I must marry her. To cut a long story short, two months into the marriage, I expected to see some signs of pregnancy, but nope. Six months into the marriage. She didn't look like a pregnant woman, so I confronted her, right? Yeah. Mr. Man, shine your eyes. There's more to it than meets the eyes. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize that you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, Google, you. you have been deceived. Before you jump into conclusion. Before you take a decision or action, investigate. Oh. Investigate. Hey, hey, before you make a mistake, try a mistake that you rig. I have a question to ask you. Okay. What could be bothering my husband? Before, before we got married, you told me you were one month pregnant. And it's been six months without any signs of pregnancy. I lost the pregnancy. What? Yes. Wait, something like that happened and you kept it away from me? Your husband? I didn't tell you because I knew it was going to break you. 
considering how much you desire twins. Wait, you were pregnant with twins? You lost them? And you thought it was the right thing to do not to have passed across that information to me? I'm very sorry. Okay. I understand. Okay, so let's say you you were pregnant and um, you lost our babies and you made a decision not to tell me. That's fine. At least we've been living happily. As man and wife. So tell me, why haven't you gotten pregnant? It's been six months. Babe. Yeah. I mean, we've been having sex for over six months. So I suppose you should have gotten pregnant again. I'm not God that gives children. You have been deceived. Oh, Mugogio. You have been deceived. Before you jump into a conclusion, before you take a decision or action, investigate. So all along she's been playing games. But how could she play games? She knew I loved her. I could have married her regardless. How desperate can women be? How? I've been a fool for love. Hello? Hi, Mom. I'm okay. How are you? I hope there's no problem. What is going on in your marriage? You and Brenda have been married for the past three years. Why haven't you two produced offsprings? Um, children are God's gift. They will come at the right time. Murphy, are you the one saying this? You told your mom and I that you got married to that girl because she was pregnant for you. Suddenly you are changing? Uh, she had a miscarriage. Really? I never mentioned it to us. Mom, her miscarriage got me broken. Sorry about that. But it's been a long time. What is keeping her from producing more children? Yes, she lost the pregnancy. But it didn't stop her from getting pregnant again. Your mother recommended Caroline. Alright? With the intention that when you return from Canada, both of you will settle down. But you refused her. You said you don't have feelings for her. What of Juliet? You said you don't love Juliet anymore. What did you do? You decided to go for Brenda. Okay? Now, look at where it has landed you. Murphy, I want to carry my grandchildren before I die. 
Mom. God's time is the best. I know. Tell me, when will that be? Exactly. Look, Murphy. It is not everything you do that you go away with. Alright? Do you know why? The law of karma demands that you take responsibility for all your actions. Murphy, where are you coming from by this time of the night? You left this house since morning to the office. Where exactly are you coming from by this time? Such an unconventional way to welcome your husband. Don't even tell me it's traffic. Because I passed through that same road. Where are you coming from? Brenda, shouldn't you at least ask me? What happened? Why are you coming back so late? As opposed to fighting me. <sighs> Murphy, where are you coming from? Next time you say traffic. It's not any traffic. There is no traffic on that road though. I passed through that road. Where are you coming from? Murphy, where are you coming from? Where are you coming from by this time of the night? Where are you coming from? Murphy, answer me. Where are you coming from by this time of the night now? Talk! I've had a long day. Alright? I need to get some rest, please. I'll find out who she is. I certainly will find out who she is. And when I do, I need not tell you what I would do to her. Because you know the wife you married. You know who you married. Look at the time you come back. Come back to the house. What's the time? This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your life. Morphe. Morphe. You still have not answered me. Answer me, Where are you coming from now? Can I get some rest? I had a long day at work today, please. I called you three times. And you did not take my call. Who is the girl that you were with that made you not to answer any of my calls? I'm sorry, I didn't know you called me. I didn't see my phone ring. Who is she? Brenda, besides, my mother called me and asked me to come over to the house. Lies. Fat lies. Okay, what did you even take me for? A fool? Huh? Can I ask you a question? Why, why should I lie to you? <laughs> what are you doing for me? Why should I lie? Take for an instance, if I decide to have an extramarital affair, just like you assume. Side check, right? I can bring anyone here or do whatever I like and nothing is going to happen. So I demand my respect because I am the man of this house. Me? Respect a cheat like you? <laughs> Funny world. Cheats. The same cheat you called your ex. You deceived me into getting married to you. You said so many lies. Sometimes I can't even figure them out because they make me sick. I shouldn't be in this marriage because you're such a liar. Cheats! Cheats! Where are you coming from? That's the question. Cheats! I 
find her. I'm very sure that you definitely found something in this bag. What you both have been using together. You know, except you don't use protection because the way I look at you, you want to enjoy every. Give me my bag. Give me which bag. Give me my bag. <laughs> Give me my bag. I food. I'll be the never tell my say any food down for anything. The repercussions of your actions will come. Look at what the dog say any food down until I look at you chop. My friend, give me my bag. What are you searching for? It's like you to blot out your wife's stomach. You'll be doing rubbish. Important man. What did you say? You heard me right. What did you call me? You cannot get me pregnant. You're an impotent man. Are you insane? I got you pregnant before you got married to me. <laughs> Murphy, I was never pregnant. What? I was never, ever pregnant. She was never pregnant. How? She is such a perfect fraud. She lied her way into my life and made me leave Julie. What have I gotten myself into? Come in. Madam, Oga, good evening. Um, Oga, I see my kettle then done with you. Not hungry. Okay. You have been deceived. Oh, Mugogio, you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, Mugogio, you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, Mugogio. You have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, Mugogio, you have been deceived. <clears throat> Sweetheart. Yes, darling. Did I tell you I got a call from my king this afternoon? No, you didn't mention that to me. Ah, my bad. It must have skipped my mind. Possible. You are thinking about other things I don't understand. Hey, you have come again. Wait, let me take this call. Ah, who must be calling you at this time of the night? Yes, if not Brenda. Terrorist. Hello? Hello, mommy. Good evening. Good evening, darling. How are you? I'm fine, mommy. How is daddy? Very well. And you? He's here. He's fine. Well, thank God. Uh, mommy, I'm so sorry I couldn't call my husband to the house this evening. He actually came from the office. Yes, he said so. Uh, I was even planning on sending a message across to you before to come for lunch. Because we have a whole lot to talk about. Okay, mommy. How about your leg? Mm. Arthritis is always there now. Here and there, managing it. <laughs> Coupled with old age, what do you expect? Oh, yes, yes, sure. Sure. Uh, but it has to cure, which is why I insisted you continue going for proper checkup in the hospital. I always go, Brenda. I always go. I, I always go. It doesn't go. See, even here, and I'm lying down. This thing is just drawing my knee. Okay, mommy. I'll call you tomorrow morning, okay? Good night, ma. Good night, darling. Bye. Now you are you are saying you are old. Yeah. After you be telling me you are a young girl. Eh? Chief. Mm -hmm. I must admit to my daughter that I'm getting old. And to you, mm -hmm. we are aging together. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you are not old. 
You will always be new for me. Are you not coming to make love to me at this night? Hmm? Won't you make love to me at this night? Oh, give me my computer. I'm doing something important. Excuse me. Stop, Joe. Please don't touch me. Where to? I'm going downstairs to watch football. You're going downstairs to watch football? Yes. Yeah, they cannot even pull the shot. My husband is always going downstairs to watch people when he cannot pull a proper shot. This is what I get every night. Every night, you are going to watch football. Night to the next morning, you're watching football. To pull a proper shot. You and I will watch that football together. Then I will show you where the real men play. They play at the proper place. Watch that football together, and then you will play at the proper place. That's what I'm going to do. This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your lies and deceit Because you want to take her place You put her in shame and disgrace For you it's just a race hey, You want to win this race Now that you have won the race See, I don't want to they come that name again. Don't they come down my love again? I don't like him. Jump with Jojo one. Just take your time. Don't they come that name again? Come open gate for me. They go market. 
to my own house. Huh? And it's busy for me now. Huh? Who knows I love you? No, 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 tell me that thing again. I wish I'm saying you love me. Eh? I get that. Me and you know say you no know love me. You just get up now, Tobol. You just do me to turn. Me and you know say no you love me. <sighs> How are you going to talk like that? Eh? You know say I love you so much. I love you past my mother and Archie. I love you past my mother and Archie. I love you past my mother and Archie. <laughs> you know, you know, no, no, you be the only man who I love for this whole while. I do what? <laughs> Hey, hey, but Agatha, may I ask you? You sure say no let me the go shine this thing? Hmm. You say women are not trust you now. I don't trust you more. I don't trust you now. Let me go back. Ah, Agatha. Show say this girl, no, they whine me. Eh? Because Agatha, mom, uh, I want to Just they just they do me like a ball. Just they turn me like a ball. Me, I don't even trust what she just do here now. Eh? Ever since we Agatha entered this compound, now I can't fall in love now. Eh? Come pursue my girl, we just live for the next uh, compound. In it. Eh? Yeah, one ball of dinner, what I'm ready to see. In it, now I'm ready to go. Because of Agatha, come pursue in it. Eh? Because in it, they tire. I'm not in it, 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 now you live in fear running from here to there because you are not sure of yourself anymore. Hey, you're afraid of the consequences of your actions. Don't forget that what you do today, you will pay for someday. It's just yes, yes, I know this is not a friendly visit. Brenda, what brings you to my house? Tell me, I don't know the reason I am here. Should I tell you something? You are the least person I expected to see in my house anymore. Desmond, what use is a tail to a cow if the tail is cut off? What does that mean? Figure it out yourself. But I must warn you, stay away from my family! You know what? Brenda, I left you for God to judge you. I have more important things to do than this nonsense you, you're here to say. Desmond, swear that you have no hand in my childlessness. <laughs> swear! <laughs> you know what? I think he has already started judging you. Can you just leave my house? Can you just leave? Do you have a house? Can you just leave? Do you have a house? I won't warn you again. Now you leave. Running from here to there Because you are not sure of yourself anymore hey, You're afraid of the consequences of your actions Don't forget that what you do today You will pay for someday It's just a matter of time What brings you to my house? Tell me, I don't know the reason I am here. Uh, should I tell you something? You are the least person I expected to see in my house anymore. This month, what use is a tail to a cow if the tail is cut off? What does that mean? Figure it out yourself. But I must warn you, stay away from my family! You know what? Brenda, I left you for God to judge you. 
I, I have more important things to do than this nonsense you, you're here to say. Desmond, swear that you have no hand in my childlessness. <laughs> swear! <laughs> you know what? I think he has already started judging you. Can you just leave my house? Can you just leave? Do you have a house? Can you just leave? Do you have a house? I won't warn you again. Now you live in fear Running from here to there Because you are not sure of yourself anymore hey, You're afraid of the consequences of your actions Don't forget that what you do Okay, then you're my son. Trust me. Surprise, surprise. Barrister Juliet. I will call you back. Wow. Mrs. Brenda Murphy. Good to see you. Why do I sense jealousy in those words of yours? Jealousy? <laughs> Jealous of who, if I may ask? <laughs> Jealous that I am Muffy's wife. That I got married to the handsome Muffy. While... The barrister is still single. <laughs> well, Mrs. Murphy, if this is the reason why you are here, I suggest you leave because I have a court to attend in no time. Not so fast. Now listen up. I am here to warn you to undo whatsoever you did against my husband and I. What is wrong with you, Brenda? I am not your problem. I thought you said you wanted a Yankee husband and God answered your prayers. By the way, what are you still doing in Nigeria? This will be the very first and last I would come here to warn you. Release my children that you've caged in your witchcraft coven. Else, I will release Holy Ghost fire on you. Leave, Brenda. You need not ask me to go. I'll be on my way. But do not make me come back. Don't. Now you leave. Running from here to there Because you are not sure of yourself anymore hey, You're afraid of the consequences of your actions Don't forget that what you do today Madam, honestly, I'm very excited for this opportunity And I also want you to tell your boss that I'm grateful And he should let me know when it is time for me to sign the contract No problem And one more thing, you know oh! that So she's the one. She is the one, right? I told you I was going to catch you. Can you stop I told you I will catch you red handed. You thought I was kidding. Brenda. Hey! So you have been the one frolicking round town with my husband. I beg your pardon. You didn't know he's a married man. You beg my father. Hey, stop that. No, wait, 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 listen. No, no, wait, wait. Let me be stop. Can you can you go 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 to the car lot? Can you leave leave please please leave leave. I'll, I'll meet you outside. What's wrong with you? Fast fast snatcher. Leave me alone, Brenda. Brenda. 
Have you lost your mind? I'm just wondering why she would badge into my house like that just to accuse me of something I didn't do. You better go and sort yourself out, honestly. You better go sort yourself out. So just sort yourself out. You better go and sort out yourself. Just stop stopping my life. Baby, yeah. I am so happy. I am so excited. I'm going to be a father of two children in just one shot. <laughs> I can't wait to put to bed so I can be as free as the bed. Is that your own concern? Yes, now. You think it's easy to carry a human being for nine good months, nine months of discomfort, and all the stress that comes with pregnancy. I celebrate every pregnant woman. Thumbs up to every pregnant woman in the whole wild world. Don't forget also be the expectant mother so. Oh, how can I forget that my beautiful wife is an expectant mother? Come on. I love you so much. I love you too. <laughs> um, let me call my friend. Uh, you mean Desmond? Who else? Do I have another friend? You see, that guy is a big boy now. A big shark. Big contractor. He wins contract everywhere. In fact, uh, the guy just the cash out anyhow. And he's going to be my twin's godfather. How do you know? <laughs> Are you reading my mind? I know. <laughs> Yeah, hello, my guy. How are you doing now? I'm good. How are you? How is your wife? Uh, she's doing great. She's in here with nice me. Nice to know. <laughs> oh, oh, nice to know that. Nice to know that. Yeah, you know, this one, we went to the hospital. Scam confirmed that my wife is carrying twin boys. Wow! Wow, this is good news. Are you serious? Thank you. To know. Oh, is that your wife? Our wife, oh, how are you? <laughs> I'm fine. Good afternoon, sir. Congratulations. <laughs> I just want to beg you that you will be my children's godfather. Your yeah, godfather? Eh? <laughs> uh, uh, why not? Why not? I'm so excited, honestly. Hmm? I'll, yes, yes, I'll definitely be their godfather. Huh? <laughs> Okay, thank you, my children's godfather. <laughs> yeah, hello. Yeah, hello, Des. Where are you now? I came out. I want to see one or two persons. Uh, it's okay. When you're ready, just give me a call. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes, yes. Okay, maybe when I'm done, I'll call you, okay? It's all right. It's all right. All right. Have a nice day. So, baby. Yeah, baby. How are you doing? I'm fine. If you're good. Fine. Have you taken something? Yes, I have. I'm okay. All right. <laughs> so, don't worry. I, I'm just going through some stories in this magazine. Okay. I'll join you up. All right. Okay? Have fun. All right. Sure. This is, this is good. <laughs> Harold, Harold. Wow. 
Give you now. Okay, now, go keep it till you carry come for market for kitchen now. Do the win in the kitchen. For waiting now, eh? You go inside. I wanna first. Now when mm. I go inside, beside don't come back. Or for now. On the outside. I, I get, you see this thing here? You get sense. What is the way you talk? Eh? No, let me go touch the ground again. I go carry you my city of baby. You're not good. Yes. I see. You were saying something over the phone. What was that? Mm, yeah, you said you were in the court then. Yeah, I was. But I'm here now. So tell me, did anything happen? That stupid girl came to my place, Brenda. She was threatening fire and brimstone that I should not do whatever I did against her and her so-called husband. Oh. Can you just imagine that? Oh my God. Wait, why are you laughing? Like, because this is... Is so it funny? funny? It's funny to me. Yes, because Brenda actually blocked me on my way to this place. She was saying all sorts of rubbish. She said, she even called me a witch, telling me to undo what I did to her so she can give pets to her children. She was even trying to, you know, rain down the Holy Ghost fire on me like it was so dramatic. Brenda. I'm telling you. Like seriously. 
You're not what? kidding. Are you kidding me? I'm serious. Oh my god, that girl is shameless. Where she I is to you. She is shameless as anything I can think of. So she had the gold to come to me and also come to you. Can you can you, can you just imagine that? You know what, Desmond? Mm. Just forget about Brenda and her frustration. Who is still talking about Brenda? Anyway, she's by bygone. Oh, can you imagine how time flies? Just look at you. Juliet, that was just in that university that year. Are you for real? Now a legal practitioner. Oh my God. <laughs> it's called your wonderful. You're honestly. beginning to bust my <laughs> head. <laughs> Juliet. It's a girl being the The winner today, Wagawa, Wanke, Wolo, Aga, 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 You keep staring at me out of proportion. Suddenly, the feelings I have for you is growing every passing day. Juliet, please, I want to be that man that will grow old with you. Each night, I close my eyes. All I see is you. Stretching forth your hands. Yes, I don't know the meaning of that. But I know that I love you. I love you deeply. Please, can you accept this love of mine? I've guided my heart with so much jealousy ever since my last heartbreak. I am scared to death. I knew what it felt like. I was broken. I was shattered. It was as if the world was crumbling on me. God, what did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Because you want to do Don't I deserve to be happy? Don't I? In shame and disgrace. For you just a race. Why must it be this moment when I thought I have found love? Why would you take away the joy that you gave to me? Why? What did I do? Because the truth has a way of coming out at last. What did she do to you? A bogini come for you to treat her this way. Running from here to where does the 
You're afraid of the consequences of your actions. I was at the verge of losing my mind. Until my call up later came from NYSA. So I left Asaba for my service in Yola. After my service, I left to Lagos for law school. At the completion of my law school, I was called to bar and here yeah, I yeah. am. That's mind. For three years, three years I refused to give my heart to any man. Because I do not want the ugly experience I had before repeating itself. I understand. Listen. I will not hurt you. Hurting you is hurting myself. I understand how you feel. You know it happened to me. Okay. I wallowed in self-pity. It's okay, please. It's okay. People mocked me. They laughed at me. Apart from Harold, every other person called me a fool. I know what it feels like. We will, we were betrayed by those we once loved. But it's fine. Here we are again. We shouldn't let this be the end of us. Let's try love once again. If not for Harrod, maybe I won't be here by now because he never left my sight for once. Harrod left his family house, joined me, stayed with me, because he knew I was going to take my life. Can we try this again? I beseech you. I love you. I love you. Mr. Murphy, I am going to arrest your wife for assault. Madam, please, I'm sorry. I, I apologize on her behalf, please. Please, stop this, Mr. Murphy. <laughs> what kind of wife is she? Eh? Is she the only one that is married? I, I, I'm very, very sorry, Ma. I promise you, it will never repeat itself again. Of course, <laughs> of course. Eh? We are withdrawing whatever deal we have with your company. You know what? I already call Mr. Weber first. Do not call our company again. No, no, ma'am. Please, I'm so sorry. Do, do, don't do this to me. I, 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 need, I need this contract. Please, 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 ma'am. Please, ma'am. Mr. Murphy, Mr. Murphy, if this is the kind of wife you are married to, I am sorry to tell you, your marriage is heading to doom. Ha! Ah, please, I got to go. Thank you. Hello? Hello, ma'am. Shouting. Shouting? D did you say I'm shouting? Uh uh. I have a headache. Please. 
Brenda, I just lost a contract worth over 100 million because of your stupidity, because of your madness. What contract? That woman you fought, that woman you embarrassed, is a representative of Fox Agency. Yes, the same company I told you I've been chasing for over three months. Did you know? Well, I'm sorry. You're sorry? You have done your worst. What else can you do? This marriage is over. You are calling it quits? Yes. Because of this singular act? Yes, I am done. Yeah! Story for the gods! <laughs> story, story, story. You have been deceived. Oh, Mugogio. You have been deceived. Before you jump into conclusion, before you take a decision or action, investigate. What kind of woman is this? Look at what I brought upon myself. Harold warned me. My parents did too. Desmond warned me. He did. He asked me to stay away from his wife to be, but I felt I could intimidate him with my wealth. I snatched his wife from him. Now, I'm to pay for what I did to a fellow man like me. I don't have peace. I don't have peace since I married Brenda. Kama has caught up with me. I can't continue. This is where I draw the line. What's it been happening for house uh, yesterday night? No, go on, go madam. What's it happening? What's it happening? What's it happening? I did kitchen. Change the cook my food. I hear everything constant. And now they ask you, what's it going to happen? I guess I'll go madam make him lose 100 million by. Hey, you mean it? How? How come? I got talk to Oga Madam Konko in office. Who mm. can't see one empty? He can't give a slap. It buy. Hey. That be the end though. Mm. This has to give a hot slap. The empty con the it contain clothes. Mm. Hey. Ah ah. Is she? Hey. Now I got talk say you know I'm married again. Say make Oga Madam carry thing. They go in Papa house. Say. Marriage don't finish. He rich now. We pay one hundred million naira. Ha! He rich to account some marriage ubiko. I say I say everything don't shake shake rich. That's why I say making kind of thing they go in Papa house. Say you know they marry again. So say everything don't happen. Say making they go. Say you know they never marry again. Hey, Oga Madam. So eh, ah, hey. Nah, that's what he do. That's what he don't do. Eh? Hey, eh? I don't think say now you the beat for me. I'm going to do it. I'm going to cook. 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 i I'm so, so, so sorry. So sorry. I am tired of your stupidity. I am tired of your bad behavior. Get out! Please. I never knew she was your business associate. Oh, really? Please. You never knew? Listen to me. What's the point of this marriage? 
Huh? What's the point getting married to you if you can't trust me? Just get out. Please don't do this to us. Please, my love, please. Oh, please. There's no us. The last time I checked, there's no us. Get out! I'm so sorry, please. If you throw me to the wood, my enemies will laugh all the living daylight out of me. I am tired of lying to my parents. I can't keep doing that. Get out. I'm going to throw you out. Love you. What? I love you with my life. You love me with your life. Yes. So well, that's not true. You love the fact that I just got in from Canada. The fact that I'm rich. Right? No. No. Huh? No, 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 no. No. I love you with my life. Please, get out. Jonathan! Now that you've achieved your aim, what is wrong? Take this box out of here. My husband, please. I'm you have put her through pain and shame. Oh, I slap you. Don't touch me again. My love. Now you leave me here. Running from here. Please, please, you can't be good. Please, please, please. Please, you are not sure of yourself please. anymore. Please, honey, my love, madam, madam, my love, madam, oh, 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 good luck. Is it me? Are you mad? Madam, Okay, I will beg him. Oh, I will beg him. Uh, go. I will go inside and beg him. I will talk to him. Man, man, you know, man with man, we will talk. Oh, who is the man? That's man. My husband is a man. No, hey, what up? You look like my husband. Send me to go and beg him. Beg him that I am sorry. Send that I will not do it again. Send that I will not do it again. Just beg him. No, go and beg him. I will beg him. I will beg him. Let's go together. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come, come, come on. Let's go. Come, come. Let's go. Come on. Hey! My love! Huh? Madam, I'm going to go. One more. Oh, God, I sent her away. Oh, bye bye. My love. It is gone. My love. Oh, God, I sent her away, sir. No. Mm -mm. You want to go with her? God forbid. You want to go with her? No, sir. Mm -mm, but she, 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 she said I should beg him. Send him to I said, God forbid, though. I can't beg. It has happened. My friend speak English. What, what, what? I said, it is weird. Can I go inside, sir? What is the problem? What happened? <laughs> Brenda, come down and talk to me. Brenda! Come talk to me. Tell me everything that happened. Sit. Sit here. Sit! What is it? What happened? Tell me what happened. And as it happened, Can't you talk again? Pull yourself together and tell me what happened. Well, 
my husband threw me out because because I went to his office and and and, and saw him chatting and and laughing heartily with another woman. He has not answered anything. Because you saw him laughing heartily with another woman. Was the reason he threw you out of the house? So tell me what happened. I, I started fighting the lady. I, I slapped her. <laughs> what? I didn't hear you. Brenda. You saw a woman in your husband's office, probably a client. And all could have come to your mind was to start fighting the client. Who taught you that? I didn't know. I, I didn't know she was a client. <laughs> because of the way they were chatting and laughing. Probably they should have been crying and discussing the business. You would have felt better like that. Really? Okay, what do you want me to do for you now? Please. Hmm. I want you to beg my husband on my behalf, please. Oh. It will happen again. I want to use me to clean up your mess. You goofed and you want to use me comfortably. I don't think I am cut out for that. Please. I didn't know what came over me. This will not happen again. I will do it again. You know you went overboard, right? So clean it up yourself. Make amend yourself. Young ladies of these days, you don't know how to manage your husbands and your homes. Now you're crying. I don't get it. I don't get it one bit. You mean Brenda embarrassed someone in your office? Yes. She embarrassed me right in front of my clients. What was wrong with Brenda? Maybe you should ask her. She's in the house. She's where? She's in our house? What the hell is she doing there? That is what... That mom, my wife, and myself saw this morning in the house. Listen, she should go to her parents. She shouldn't come to mine. You know what? I don't even care. I don't care. Bros, you see, I blame you in all of this. I want you to stay clear of another man's wife. But no, people claim is in love. She staged everything. She put up all of this drama to deceive me. Now she makes me sick. She keeps accusing me of cheating every time. Urgent. Oh, yes, I did. Murphy. Yeah. It's been three days since your wife came to us. Up till now, we've not seen nor heard from you. Why? <sighs> Dad, I honestly didn't know she was here. I asked her to leave my house. I asked her to go back to her parents. I told her I was done. She told us what she did that prompted you kicking her out of your house. Oh, she did? Yes, of course she did. Dad, I'm tired. 
since I married her. <sighs> it's been a lot of trouble. She lied about herself. She lied about everything. She even lied about getting pregnant. Yes, she lied about being pregnant. Brenda lied to you that she was pregnant? Look, she told us that she lost the pregnancy. Said that to you? Well, that's a lie. She told me she was never pregnant. Murphy. Murphy. I married you because it has been my desire to marry a Yankee guy. And what does that mean? You did not tell me you came back to settle in this country. I'm still trying to understand where you're going with this. I thought we'll be leaving to, you know, Canada immediately after our wedding. What are we still doing here? I beg your pardon? See, some people have already started laughing at me that I am yet to travel back to Canada with my husband. Some people? Yes. Brenda. You know you've been so dramatic all your life. I know that. I knew you were going to say this. Any small thing, my husband would say I'm being dramatic. No, tell me, when, when did I promise to travel with you? When did I mention I'll take you to Canada? When? I can't remember. Uh -uh. Uh, but I thought you were going to, to take us back to Canada where you schooled. Listen, before you came, I was doing something very important. All right? Can I just focus? See, I want to base abroad. Just take me to Canada. Murphy. Yeah? Murphy. Listen. If you do not take me out of this country, to overseas, yeah. I swear, you will not have a moment of peace in this house. Bet me. Do you even know what a passport looks like? I don't blame you. What I know is, take me to Canada. Take me there. I am a Canadian girl. Take me to Canada. Ah! This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your lies and deceit. Because you want to take her place. You put her in shame and disgrace. That, that she's cost me a lot of pain. And I'm tired. I want a divorce. Yay. There is nothing Teresa will not hear. Brenda wants to kill you for me. Ha! That girl is such a bad wife. She cost me a lot of pain. She wants to kill me before my... Mom, do you know this girl accused me of sleeping with my own maid? She thinks I'm having an affair with my maid. Do you know, Haru says something like that. But I never wanted to believe her. Mom, hey. I'm done. I want a divorce. Yeah, me, I believe he's better. Now that they're still alive. Life first. Like, seriously? Yes! Can't you see the kind of stress is going through already. Uh, Murphy. Yeah. In as much as I blame her for everything that happened, I can never and will never subscribe to divorce. Is that understood? Your mom called me today. She 
said Amara went into labor. Harold took her to the hospital. She's expecting twins. Viv, I'm talking to you. What would you have me say? Hello? Hey, Harold, what's up? She has been bad. Oh, really? Oh, great. My regards to her. Thank you, boss. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Talk to you later. Great. Amara just put to bed. She had twins. Viv, are you okay? It's barely one year my brother got married. Hey, Mr. Man, shine your eyes. There's more to it than meets the eyes. If you're not careful, you'll soon realize that you have been deceived. You have been deceived. Oh, who of you? You have been deceived. Before you jump into conclusion. So, Mr. Murphy, how is business going? Business is good. Business is doing well. I can't complain. I must uh, say a big thank you to your company and also to your boss um, for endorsing the contract. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Yeah. So, how is uh, your boss? It is good. It's fine. Great. So, how is your wife? My wife is fine. I was going to say I apologize once again for that slight mistake that happened the other time. Uh, so, I promise you to never happen again. Um, uh, it's fine. It's okay. And once again, thank you for uh, accepting to partner with me. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. What's wrong with you? Ah. Oh, what is it again? Come to where? You like sex too much. What's wrong with you? Is this food? Hey, it was just two rounds, so. Two rounds? And that's not enough? No. No oh, more. Please, I don't have strength. Ah. What, what's wrong with you? You're a young girl. Stop acting like you're wild. You're a young man. You should be energetic. I want you to kill me in bed. Me kill you? God forbid, I can't kill you. What's, up? What's wrong with you? Ah, oh, baby. This should be your biggest flex. Making me see that you can scatter me in I bed. can't scatter you. Stop saying that. You're making me scared. Ah, what do you mean? We just had sex two hours ago and you want more. What's wrong with you? Baby, don't be a weakling now. Real men do these things. Baby, show me your manpower. Please. I should show you my manpower. Yes, I'm sorry, I don't have any manpower. What's wrong with you? Listen, tomorrow is work. You should get some rest so you can go to work tomorrow. My child, I will wake up. See, when you finish with me for maybe another two rounds, I will sleep well and wake up strong. Listen, I'm going downstairs to watch my wrestling match. And after that, I'll come and sleep. Tomorrow, I'll go to work. I won't be the one to kill you, please. Baby, wrestling. Other times, football. Baby, come on now. Show me yourself. Show me what you're made of. Come I should show you what I'm made of. You're running away. This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. Another person you have replaced with your lies and deceit. Because you want to take her place, you put her in shame and disgrace. For you it's just a race hey, You want to win this race Now that you have won the race 
How long do you think it will last? Because the truth has a way of coming out at last. Hey, what did she do to you? <laughs> It's not yet in bed. <sighs> Babe, are you there? Babe. in the restroom. Oh. What is this still doing downstairs? Sorry, I dozed off. Why would you leave the comfort of our bedroom to the couch? Oh? I was watching TV and I... This is not your place. You shouldn't be here in the first place. To the room? Another mm -hmm. person you have replaced With your lies and deceit because you want to take her place You put her in shame and disgrace For you it's just a race hey, You want to win this race Now that you have won the race How long do you think it will last? Because the truth has a way of coming out at last hey, what, what is going on in my house? Ever since Agatha came to this house to do one stupid housemaid job for me. My husband has been leaving this room every night to go and watch football downstairs. This night, it was wrestling. <laughs> hey! I can't even explain what is happening right under my nose. I need to put my nose to the ground. I must find out what is happening. I'll get to the root of this. After you have put her through pain and shame. Oh, what a shame. Now you live in fear. Running from here to there Because you are not sure of yourself anymore hey, You're afraid of the consequences of your actions Don't forget that what you do today You will pay for someday It's just a matter of time oh, You will pay you will pay. What did she do to you? Jonathan.
Madam, good afternoon. Mm -hmm. Afternoon. Take this money. Go to the market and buy toothbrush, toothpaste, detergent, and anything else you think I'll be needing in the house. Toothbrush, toothpaste, detergent, okay. Uh, mother, who go come they forget? Don't worry, I would handle it. Just go and come back. Okay. I'm here. Madam go send me market. Say she go come there for gate. Jonathan, go market. How Jonathan go leave gate, come out, go market. Nah, nah, security me now. You're not supposed to come out for gate. Just shut up and go. Madam, madam, if Oga come back, tell and say I don't travel, go village. I don't go, I don't go village. That reminds me, babe. I bumped into Juliet and Desmond today. <sighs> hmm. Do you know Desmond actually owns a plaza? A shopping plaza? And guess what? Juliet is pregnant. She said she got married to Desmond six months ago. So she's likely to be five months pregnant. I'm very surprised. I mean, to think that Desmond actually owns a shopping plaza. That guy is rich. My brother confirmed it. And for some reason, I feel bad how I treated him in the past. I strongly believe it's good to be good Evil does not pay. <sighs> it's all good. Everything will be fine. Babe. I'll be downstairs. I have some work to do. Then after my work, <sighs> I'll watch my wrestling match. Babe, I'm going downstairs. Babe. Don't forget that what you do today, you will pay for someday. It's just a matter of time. Oh, you will pay, you will pay. What did she do to you? What did she do? Abu Guinea, come, Mary Guinea. Thank you. 
for you to train her this way. For you to treat her this way Don't forget that one day you will pay You will pay for your actions oh, oh. You will pay The repercussions of your actions will come someday oh. So this is where Morphe comes every night to be wrapped up in Agatha's waist. He is so consumed in infidelity that he does not even use his head anymore. Just tell me what that useless, dirty housemaid has that I do not have ten times fold. What exactly? I have to do this. You will pay for your actions, oh, oh, you will pay the repercussions. Oh, 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 madam, madam, hello, me, mom, I swear, I swear, I don't know what's you. I beg no face, I don't know what's you. I just say, my lover, Agatha. Madam, now you finished. Madam, I know nothing. Now you are beg. Hi, Madam, now me the nakagata. Hey, no let me the. I I come come now, ma come. Hi. Oh, I see the um um B. I know nothing. Now you. Agi, see what I've done to myself. My husband will kill me. Oh, I'm finished. What am I going to say? My husband will kill me. My husband will kill me. Oh, I'm finished. What am I going to say? Where's that noise coming from? Where's that noise coming from? It's just a matter of time. Oh, you will pay. You will pay. What did she do to you? What did she do? You, you just released your dirty semen. But I, I, I just said Agatha. Eh? You know, say your hey. laps and Agatha laps. Now the same thing. And as I, as I grab her, I can say, hey, Agatha, now I can climb. Come, uh, come the, I don't know what's you. I swear. If you, as I touch her, I can say, hey, now Agatha, and now I can, come the, sorry, ma. What's going on here? Jonathan, what are you doing here? I heard voices. What's, what's happening? What are you doing in this room? What are you doing? What are you doing here? Jonathan, what are you doing here? Madam, I swear. Ma, let me get a talk through. Huh? Ma, I talk through. Yeah? I talk through. I, I don't know it's me, then Nag Agatha. What? I don't know I can't come based on the I didn't work it. How did they take to us, you, you know, sir? Now I can't enter. I can't see a person like that. Based on the do I will talk through. I will do Agatha with the Naka, the Naka. I swear, at the Naka Agatha. So now as I enter, I can't hold the labs. I can't say, okay, now Agatha. Now I can't, I can't carry them. Now as I open my eye, now Madam. Asa, Madam, you know what I mean? I don't know what I mean. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to vest. No vest. You having sex with my wife? I said, I don't know what I mean. I don't know. It's not so. I demand to climb, Madam. You? You're sleeping with my gate, man. 
You had sex with my wife? Okay, my mistake. Because I said I know I I thought <laughs> I said, like, I see Agatha. I said, 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 Wake up and just finish what you have started now. Sleeping with my kid man. No. No. I didn't know he was the one. Let me get something straight. You left our bedroom, went straight to Agatha's bedroom, had sex with Jonathan, my kid man. How does that make you feel as a woman? How do you feel? Do you feel good? By the way, where's, where's Agatha? Where's Agatha? She, 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 she traveled. She traveled? How? When? Yeah. Travel to where? I, 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 I start to, to go and see her people. You asked her to see her people without my consent, without my approval. I'm sorry. It's just that you usually leave the room to come watch football or wrestling. So, I started suspecting that you could be sleeping with your housemate. So, I sent her away so that I could sneak into her bedroom for you to come and have sex with me. 30 minutes later, a man walked into the, to the room. I thought it was you. So, so, so. He, um, he, um, <laughs> Yeah, that sex with me four times. And then when he wanted to go the fifth time, I pushed him away. And that was when I realized it was Jonathan. I don't swear several times. I swear with everything way I like for this life. I don't know say that, madam. Get out. Huh? Hey! Come on, get out! See? Have you seen what?
suspicion, trust issues can do to you. First thing tomorrow morning, you're going to pack your things. You're going to leave my house. Speaking to my mother or my father won't help you because this marriage is over, right? So you're going to pack your things. You're going to leave my house. And I don't want you close to my father or mother because if I see you around them, I'm going to kill you. Please. Please. It's not like I, I feel like killing you right now. But I won't kill you, please. But if I see you around my parents, I'll kill you. Please, just give me, give me a second chance to make up for my wrongs, please. Just the last chance. Just give me the last chance. Please, please. So you open your legs for my gate man to have sex with you. I didn't know. I didn't know. As pretty as you are. My gate man that has body odor. <sighs> My gate man that has body odor. And you didn't you thought it was me, so I have body odor. I wasn't thinking straight. Huh? I wasn't thinking. So I have body odor, right? So you said you didn't you didn't know it was you, you didn't you didn't know it was and you thought it was me. So you're indirectly saying I you're a bitch. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I feel like punching you right now. Do you know that? Don't touch me. Please, please, please. It's just a matter of time. Finish. You will pay. You will pay. What did she do to you? What did she do? A bulgini come merigi. For you to treat her this way Don't forget that one day you will pay What did she do to you? What did she do to you? Abu Gini come Meregi For you to treat her this way Look at Jones, look at Jones come out before Before we go carry police call Who can listen me from here? Eh? My my law of Agatha. Eh? Law of on your song. Which time would I use to show Agatha for this house? Wait to wait to check with. Ah, now that time where I go market. Yes, that time I go market. Then Madam come get my push my love come up for this house. Eh? Ah, my law of Agatha. I go take look it. That includes my environment, that includes my life. 
I live on the street. So leave. I don't want to see you around here. Don't come close to my father. Don't come close to my mother. In fact, give me that ring. I forgot to say, give me my ring. Take off the ring. Take off the ring. Give me, give me, give me my ring. You don't deserve it. Give me my ring. Give me my ring. Give me my ring. I'll give it to someone who deserves it. I don't want to see you when I get back. Bitch. I don't want to see you when I get back. I don't want to see you when I get back. Bitch. Stupid bitch. Sleeping with my get back. Who is this? Who is this? Juliet, I am fine. Why are you calling me? Go straight to the points. What is it? Yeah.